I'm heading for a small island that was recently discovered called Tumblecube Island. There are traces of civilization that used to exist on this island and there could be a lot of precious loot to be discovered. Yar, I'm a pirate instead. My goal is to thoroughly explore Tumblecube Island and uncover its awesome loot. I'll be arriving at Tumblecube Island shortly. I can't wait to see what treasures await me. I've played this game for about five minutes just to check how it played and how it looked. I've done it twice actually, so I know this ocean scene like the back of my hand. Dropping any frames or anything? We're running at 60 frames per second. I think we're doing pretty alright. You can't see or hear anything. That might just be you. Everyone else is saying good things. We'll see. If you see an issue, shout about it and get everyone else to shout about it, because otherwise I won't see it. And I need all the help I can get. Free to start, always a red flag. Maybe. But then you just stop playing. If it's free to start, then the idea is that it should be so good that it makes you want to pay for it, rather than it tricks you to. I doubt it'll be a subscription-based game, you know? Pick Charm out of the start. We're not around to that yet, but we'll get to it sh soon. Beep beep boop, beep beep beep. Hmm, my Moby 4, the drone manufactured by Silphco, I brought here to detect loot is acting strange. Do I have any more exposition for three lines of dialogue? What's wrong, Moby? That's weird. I had a, um, I made a film for my last, like, my last final project for my university was a film, which I made a video game film for, and the main character was called Moba. It's a nice connection. Completely irrelevant. Boop boop. <laughs> well, I guess I have no choice but to restart it. Beep beep. We're gonna say that he's got terrible static and isn't just swearing his head off. Reset complete. Please input the owner's name. The maximum number of characters is 12. And we have a notification, which I actually heard. Woohoo! Wow, that was a really half-tired Mario there. Agiharu, thank you for the 40 bits. You haven't even given us a message, but I can see it nice and clearly now. If you do have a message whenever you give a donation, or... And yeah, it has to be a donation that you get a message for. I'll be able to say, wait, see it nice and clearly now. I've evolved! Mm -mm. Alright, this is... Very one-dimensional. You know where this is going. I'm not going to go fancy with a name. It's just me. Well, I mean, technically all my other files are called Daryl. Not that I saved them, but, you know. Uh, good morning, Daryl. Here's the news for today. I'm not interested in the news right now. Oh. I'm not interested in the news right now, Moby. I'd rather get to exploring this island. Would you go have a look around for me first? You understood. Begin scout on... Begin scouting Tumblecube Island. I stand, uh, stand by. I have no recorded data on this island. Guidance will be necessary. I'm also going to see if I can turn my mic and do that so that it's not hopefully leaning in front of me. There we go. That there. There. I can actually see more of the screen. And that one too. You've never seen this? Well, I'm not surprised. This is day one of it coming out. Or I guess technically day two. It's not even been 24 hours. No, it has been 24 hours, excuse me. Came out like 5 o'clock yesterday morning. There appear to be some Pokemon nearby that live on the island. They should be familiar with the island's landscape. Why not befriend one of them so it can show us the way? I see. Sounds like a plan. Let's try it out. So this is our chance to see the five starters. And I really like the representation on this because you got the classic Pikachu that no one cares about. Okay, everyone cares about the classic three Gen 1 starters, because this whole game takes place in Gen 1. And my favourite is the fact we've actually got Eevee, though the chances of her actually evolving seem quite low. But I'm going to have a look anyway. Um, well balanced, the toys with the opponents with its tricky moves. 101, 101. 76, 126, okay. 126, 76, yeah. You're an all-rounder, I remember you being. Oh, yeah, 101, 101. What's Pikachu? It's, it's hard to tap like this. Okay. <sighs> I don't know. I've already been told to go to Charmander. What do you guys think? I like Eevee as a character, but if she doesn't evolve, if it doesn't evolve, then, you know. Eevee's an overdone concept, but not as a starter. Your bits go for sh uh, Charmander. You can't. You can't. Ah. Uh, can't go bribing me. But then you're leaning me for it. That's. That. Okay, you've worked out how the world works a little bit. 
40 bits is 40 bits, but let's hear everyone else's arguments at least. If anything goes wrong on the overlay, do let me know. DB evolves at level 36. It's in the rev slot. Oh, so they can evolve? I don't know why I assume they can't. It just seems like because they... No, they don't even follow behind you, do they? They are you? Oh, shoot. No, so little about this. This game is bad because it's not Fortnite. Is that right? The everyone's saying Eevee, but we've got those 40 bits on uh, on Charmander. Will you be offended, Akiharu, if I uh, if I don't go for Charmander? Because I'm really leaning on that Eevee. She's all rounded. I keep calling it a she just because of its looks. Excuse me. Look at that HP. It's only 76. I thought that was defense, but no, that's full on just HP. Actually, what is it? What is a normal type? Pokemon do, because I played a little bit as Squirtle and he had a whirlpool effect that does the spinny move. I imagine Charmander's got the same. Do they all have that kind of thing? Surely not. Alright, so it looks like we can catch an Eevee later. What? No, even... Okay, as long as you can choose... You want to choose the evolution of the Eevee. Which we can get... L which we can get... You know what? Sure, we'll go with that then. I'll accept that. I completely forgot what your choice was for half a second there because you were talking about the other Pokemon. We're going to go with Eevee. If we ever um, do get around to playing Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, can't be the other way around by the way, then uh, I'll definitely play Eevee because Pikachu's a little... Pikachu's the overdone one if you ask me. Mm. It seems our preparations are complete, Daz. We'll head out and have a look around the island. Looks like how the Pokeballs become a Poker Cube now. Pokemon move towards enemies on their own and attack them. Uh, I can't remember what that reminds me of. Like probably Xenoblade or something. Uh, this whole game can be played on touchscreen, but we're using the Nintendo Switch's analog thing to just go about our day. Oh yes, that's another thing. Who thinks Dazzle will find a shiny? There are apparently shinies in this game. That's how I found out this was the full game because someone was trying to take on all of them and. I'll be very impressed if I do find a shiny. Does anyone know the odds of that? I assume it's different than the old classic games, but I could be wrong. Shinies aren't uncommon. You have two already. Okay, never mind. Eesh. Um, Pokemon no moves. They sure do. By tapping the icon for one of your Pokemon moves, I will mute my phone. You can give the order to use that move. It's just a group chat thing anyway. Uh, flail? Really? That hurts us, surely, right? Do I remember that right? Also, I can imagine that get quite noisy and annoying. What does that remind me of? I have no clue. Oh man, that reminds me of something really solidly, but I don't know what. I'm going to try Flail, because I swear Flail's the move you do when you run out of moves. No? Okay. Whatever. Um, we also have the option to, I guess, auto-attack over here. But then there's also this move, which I don't get what it does. Is it like move out? Maybe it makes more sense when you've got a group of Pokemon with you. Rattata. Really strong looking Pokemon. Oh, it is just a slightly bigger Rattata. I was going to say, it's only a Rattata. We've like fought one already. So I'll admit, from watching the uh, the announcement of this, I wasn't too hooked. People said that the gameplay looked kind of boring, and I would have agreed with you, but then people seem to really be enjoying it on Twitch at the moment. I don't know. If it's addictive, then it's addictive, you know? I had no idea what any of that was, but oh well. Power stones are important items that you can give your Pokemon to make them stronger. This is as far as I've gotten in the game now. Didn't even read this bit. As you progress through stages, you'll be able to get strong power stones. Okay. And they're just random fruit over here. Okay. Hmm, I think we need to end our expedition for now. I need to find a place where I can set up a base camp. Hmm. We need to collect some scrap and make a base, yeah? Oh, looks like I found quite a nice clearing. I'll make this my base. 
What about that bizarre stone I found earlier? Is there some way I could use it? When Daz took out the stone, the Pokemon's body started to glow. Already? No, no, that's just powering up, never, not evolving, excuse me. Try attaching the power stone you got on your expedition to your Pokemon. Okay. Uh, Pokemon on Tumble Cube Island have mysterious charms known as power charms. When you power, when you put a power stone into a socket on a power charm, it can raise the Pokemon's HP or attack. And I guess that's the only two stats it's got. Okay. Mighty Stone, dragging it to that. What are all the differences? Oh, right. Okay, that's heart, uh, HP and attack, just in symbol form. With the Everstone button, you can give a Pokemon an Everstone that will stop it from evolving. Why would I do that? But okay, where is that? I don't see where that is, so I just won't press it, yeah? Then what, now it's got plus 50 attack. Oh, I see, yeah, it was 101, it became 102 because of the level 2, now it's 152. Gotcha. This is very basic stuff, but I need to know these things. Um, looks like my Pokemon has gotten stronger. Guess it's time to start exploring. Uh, do I not? You know what? Sure, I'll look at the rest of that later. I'm sure it will teach us later. Also, my two screens are like on the opposite sides of my microphone, and I've got a big microphone anyway, so me looking at the chat is a real expedition on its own. But I'll get around to it, don't worry. I'll, I'll try and be more interactive as I can be. You can start an island expedition from the dungeon icon. Which just looks like a orange yellow square the goal of the game is to find the precious loot that lies hidden on the island as you progress on your expeditions okay have we done this level no that was just tutorial level we have oh only 30 minutes of it okay so it is adonia demo or something i don't know i can be your guide you're very far into the game okay so what was that 30 minute timer i just saw earlier like it wasn't that wasn't very far away at all Actually, what's quite ironically um, going on is I can probably, like, check out the chat during the gameplay more than anything. You know, like, everyone, from what I saw on the Twitch, everyone else was doing, like, menus and stuff. So that's probably the, uh, like, where the crux of the gameplay comes in, maybe? Like, that's the bit everyone's focused on. Flail is good for area of effect. I hope my first... Well, you know, if Daz's first shiny... Why am I calling myself third person? If my first shiny is going to be a Rattata, I'm not going to complain. A shiny is a shiny, you know? More Pokemon appeared. Wow! It's like this island is full of them. Bam. Lovely. That wasn't me being delayed, by the way. Actually, does my sound... I think my voice is in sync. I've got it set to be a slight delay because I'm, you know, streaming not on my computer directly. So, um, does audio sound fine on that front? Do I sound like I'm in sync? I'm not reacting to anything too late or early. Um, like, if I pressed nothing because I can't, because I'm on a cutscene with Meowth. Here, let me turn this out to check things are going on. And take down! There we go. I pressed the button and it took a moment for it to actually do the attack, but I hopefully that, that was in sync. Let me know. The first shiny was a Foon Goose? Or a Foongus? I thought there was only the original 151 in here. Is that is that your joke? Is that your yeah, is that your funny pun going on in here? I'm gonna pun. Zinc, don't worry. Cool. I'm just trying to be safe, because knowing me, I'll have an issue at the very beginning that no one told me, and I won't realise till five minute, minutes before the end of the stream, and then I'll look it back in re-recordings, and I'll be like, ugh. That has happened. It's not a bitter thing, just a thing I noticed. When I was doing, like, my uh, montages, I was like, that's out of sync. So I had to change the audio to be extra out of sync, to be more in sync when I'm in a montage about it later. But, nah, it's a future thing, don't worry about it. Okay, Sturdy Stone and whatever this is. They're going to tell us what these are for? Pokemon characteristics. Even if Pokemon are of the same species, they're probably slightly different. You found some ingredients it looks like you can cook with. If you cook something, it should attract some Pokemon. Ah. Okay. Oh, you were talking about the general game. Gotcha. Excuse me. I've never caught a shiny Pokemon. Maybe I haven't played the Pokemon games enough. I've only completed... Black. Wow, I've, I am really bad at Pokemon games. I've played through most of them and, and a fair bit, but never completed them. 
You're all ready to start cooking now. Use the ingredients you found on TumbleCube Island to cook up some dishes for Pokemon. Okay. So I click on this and then put stuff in. When you cook up some food, Pokemon that like that kind of food will come visit your base. Tap an ingredients icon to put that ingredient in your cooking pot. I'll tap one. Once you fill the pot, you're ready to cook. Um, we'll go with this. No, no, it won't let me put that in. Okay. We'll go with a bulk berry, an apricorn, tiny mushroom. I wish for... No, can I not? Click and drag? Ah, okay. We took just... Wait, can I not put in the other ones? It only wants me to put in mushrooms. Okay. Fine. I cannot reach. I cannot aim. Oh! You're telling me exactly which ones to put in. Okay. It's not as fun, but I get ya. The ingredients will be used when used up when you cook. Yes, we know. Does it take time? Yes. When your dish is finished cooking, will depend on how many times you've gone out on expeditions on your island. Use PM tickets, which are special items. You can finish cooking your dish right away. Just in, just this time, here's some PM tickets you can use to finish your cooking your dish right away. Your dish will be ready for two more expeditions, or we'll use these. Mulligan Stew a la Cube. Whatever ingredients you like. Favorite food of Pokemon on Tumble Cube Island. Just some. Doesn't tell you which ones. Oh wow, and it's immediate. That would make sense, otherwise you're waiting twice. Rattata became your buddy. And... Congratulations, you befriended a new Pokemon. Now keep on befriending more Pokemon. I'll tap on this one then. Pidgeotto became your buddy. Right, let's add um, one of those bulky stones to somebody, shall we? Let me edit the team first, which is apparently a thing I need to manually do. Makes sense. Right, you can be... Wait, so does it make a difference which one's which? Like, which order? Probably not. Two close range and one long range team. Okay. There's a lot to do. There's like training and everything. There's very clearly a timer up here. Is that just a demo timer or what? Your cooking board is empty. Why not start cooking another dish before heading out next? Look, we've got just less than 20 minutes. Do I need to be concerned about that or am I good? Oh, auto set. Sure. Your ingredients will be set randomly. Okay. We'll go with it anyway. Saves time. And all that. Your dish will finish cooking if you've gone on a few expeditions. Don't forget to start woof, making your mic fall down on you. Why is it doing that? Why are you top heavy? There you are. Now you ain't gonna fall down on me. <sighs> what is going on with all my spacings on my Nightbot things? I need to change that. I didn't even realize they were an issue until today. So see you later, Bean. I'm very out of touch because I'm doing all this reading. The timer's cooking pot. Um, maybe? It's battery. You can do a certain amount of expedition. Ah, okay. Also, I've realized I've missed a couple of notifications because they're bloody silent. Thank you, Sonic Lover, for the follow, and Aiden for the host. Let's get back to this. Uh, we're ready to... No, we're not ready to... I want to do a thing first. It's not an option. I can't give them my stones. Okay, <laughs> who needs them? Did I get to watch the TRG Coliseum? I did not. I did not at all. Didn't even know it was a thing. I'm very out of touch because YouTube notifications and all that. The total of your team members HP and attack is your team's strength. At each spot where you can head out on an expedition, the strength of enemies will be displayed. This should give you an idea of what your team's strength should be. Pokemon with the same type as the bonus type for the place you're heading out on an expedition to will have a higher HP and attack than normal, making them stronger than they usually are. Okay, we're 660, and what, we're going back to, going back to 1-2? One, okay, I guess we didn't do, last time was 1-1, one, one, and the last time was tutorial before that? I don't know. So why does an expedition require us to kill everything we see? You know? Yeah. 
beautiful. What's left? We got you there. Let's focus energy, just generally power up. Okay. Now I know is that admittedly is a lot more fun now, because there's just six buttons, to, well, four buttons to press. Did that hurt the people around it? I cannot tell. I timed that completely wrong. Go me. <gasps> it's a metapod! I remember the days when a metapod was weak, or strong even. I still can't tell if that's actually doing damage or if they're just generally already taking damage or not. Alright, Pidgey. Get a good aim on it. Lovely. BAM! Wow, this has got a lot of health. Okay, yes, I think that is hurting them. Lovely! If you press X or Y, you can use an ability. Is the, um... Alright, is people having stream lag now? Let me know. Yes, we've had a lot of frame drops. Okay. We might just have to go with it. There are some change settings. We'll, we'll see how things go. Hello, if you are new to the stream, we are playing Pokemon Quest. The new Pokemon game that came out of nowhere yesterday. We have 10 minutes before hopefully the pottery is done. Or we are. Um, let's go to the base. I want to cut. See if I can uh, give away those stones now. So, Rattata doesn't have any good moves. So we'll give this... Ooh, got a couple actually. Okay. Oh wait, this guy's got space for two? Well then, I'll give him two. Why not? One might actually give more health. I'm gonna give more health to Eevee. I probably could have done that way quicker by like pressing L to switch straight to Eevee, but oh well. Yeah, this is mostly menus, isn't it? I can see that working out. Just like that. I have no idea what all the rest of this is, but okay. I assume the two are connected now. We've got some quests to do. This reminds me of just like Nintendo eShop style. It's a nice, it's a nice aesthetic. It receives items such as re as rewards for your activities. Sometimes you can even unlock PM tickets. Great. First step it. Wait. Less stone. Plus one. I guess it means one expedition after the tutorial. I have not a clue. Let's just get out there. Hello Hazard, thank you for joining us. Okay. Yeah, we can take this. We've got about right enough strength. You can also tap the icon in the top right to switch without going out. Okay. Now I know. I will most likely forget, but now I know. Right. Ring. Rattata, you, you really can't do anything right now, so just exist for us, will you? We'll power you up and then make that do nothing. Well, actually, I guess you're doing. It makes your auto attacks better. What does this symbol mean? He's boosted. Ah, uh, he's boosted from his own uh, focus energy. That's probably what it is. Excuse me, explaining my own questions here. Thank you very much. Are all these expeditions going to be the same? Maybe it's because it's level one, but like. Oh, it makes a tornado? I thought it was a bunch of blowing. Never mind. Um, because like now it's got more, okay. There's two rounds of more Pokemon appearing at least. Like, is it always the same? I imagine probably not, because people would have gotten way bored of it by now. I wasted that gust, but oh well. Oh, it says this was a fighting type arena, but this is very clearly like just normal types and a little bit of fire type. Oh well. This should be good, right? Special effects are special effective, no? Oh. That wasn't that wasn't the final guy. I have no idea what all the symbols around me mean either. <laughs> Do excuse me in my ignorance, I'm still learning the ropes. BAM! How many are there in this round, then? Is that 
Is the top right corner, which I keep actually not being able to see, is that like all the rounds, I guess? That makes sense. <gasps> Evolved Pidgeotto. Again, this is still this still isn't a fighting type. This is just flying types now. Ah well. Thank you for the mushroom. Let's do some flailing. I missed. Flying versus flying. Ooh, was that a critical hit, maybe? Not tell. Ah, I messed up. There's quite a lot of damage these guys are doing, like the numbers wise. It does look like Minecraft and Pokemon Smash together, but it's quite, it's quite like cute. It's not like a terrible game. It's not the most crazy in gameplay yet, but maybe hopefully it'll expand. So what? Do we get another HP slot for Pid? No, that was just one we didn't use. Maybe for Rattata. Hmm. I have no idea what those icons are, but thanks. Whatever they are. Fighting type area means fighting type Pokemon are more powerful in the area. Not that all Pokemon are fighting. Right. Okay. Bit weird, though, that they gave us that straight away. Because none of the starters were fighting types. And these enemies clearly aren't going to be. But okay. Thanks for the explanation, Pika fan. That's a lot of damage. Uh, everything seems to be going fine for now. The barber you go out on the island, the stronger the wild Pokemon get. You should collect more power stones and befriend more Pokemon to get stronger as you heard before other as you head farther out. Okay. Uh, what's going on with you then? Something new? No? Okay. I thought the thought the symbol meant something. I guess I have to go to base to edit my actual team. Which is a bit strange. The Pokemon that want to be your buddies will come to your base every 22 hours. If you've encountered a rare Pokemon during an expedition, there's a chance it may come to visit your base too. Nice. You've completed some main quests. Would you like to check them out? Sure. Was it the first step or no? Oh, it's these. Oh, I didn't res- okay. Thank you very much. If some items be going to recruit one quest, if you get stuck during the expedition, it might be good to take on some quests. Recharge the battery. Not quite sure how we did that, but alright. What else we got? Move learning, get power stones, PM tickets, level up, training. Ooh. Well, is this Rattata new? Because if they are, I might give them some training. We'll see what they're up to. No, this is R3. Okay. Didn't actually know we could look around here. Ooh. Wow. That's a nice boat. I like that boat. Um, edit team. We're now at 802 on attack power. Um, have I already forgotten how to give away stones then? Was it this? It was that. Okay, strange. Um, we've got a, a power slot. We can give it to Rattata. Does Eevee have a slot, preferably? No. Okay. Tatter it is. We'll just keep boosting him to be a glass cannon kind of guy. Give him all the attack and very little HP. Tatter Rattata in the real world, what would you name it? Rattata. No need to confuse it. But maybe that's a bit racist, because it's a species. I can get a new Pokemon now. How can I do that? Oh, because it's open. I see. I assumed it would automatically open. <laughs> I'll explain my own answers. <gasps> Vulpix! I am sold on the Vulpix, thank you very much. Come on over, please. Um, let's put some stuff in here. I'm just gonna auto-set it. Actually, no. That's not what I wanted, I want to reset. Oh, I can't put that in. Let's put... Okay. No, that's okay. Do it this way then. This guy, and then all of these guys. We don't have enough room for all of them. That's okay. Why does this use three? That's three at a time. Okay. Oh, I think I told you what you get at the top. But okay. Um, Volpix, I want you on the team instead of Rattata. I think. At the moment. I do not know how to do this. Oh, probably just full on no. 
How am I this rusty on it all already? Because we're not on the right mode, right? That's cool. There's a lot of stats. Which is it? Ah! No, Everstone, please. I would like. Is that bad at this? Click on Vulpix, really? I thought I did. Why are they like that? Okay. A weird Pokemon. That's not, it's not doing me a thing. Unless I'm supposed to like click and drag it. Don't think so. Or do I click on these guys and then replace them because I'm going on that instead of edit team? No. Uh, okay, that's strength and HP. That's just its statsy stuff. Do I need to get to this next bit? Doesn't, doesn't tell me. Hmm. Click edit team. Did I not do this this whole time? Did I keep missing that? Well, oh, that's what I first pressed. Apparently not. Okay, excuse my me and my dumbness. Putting you back, putting Vulpix in. So, uh, Rattata, I would quite like to put your stuff back first. I'm not sure if I can give away my stones if you're in the team. Let me go to you. Oh, I don't know. How did I not press edit team first? I thought that was the first one I pressed. I'm an idiot. Is the uh, conclusion you can get from that. I am an idiot. But look at how dexterous I'm getting at the menus now. So good. Right, Rattata, get out of here. Volpix, get in here. And let me level you. Look, there's an easy button to do the power chain here, but not to go backwards. That's that's what confused me. And Volpix doesn't even have a, uh, have a slot for this. <sighs> but I'm gonna give it, yeah. I'm gonna give this one to him. No, no, no. Give... I'm on Pidgey. I'm gonna give Pidgey... Uh, we don't have a heart one out? We just have two strength ones? Fucking... Uh, I don't know. So there's not a slot for that last power stone then. Is that what I'm getting out of this? We have an extra power stone readily available. Well, I can give you a stronger one. How's that sound? And then Vulpix, you've only got HP slots, yes? Yes, and we don't have a HP slot for you. Okay. <sighs> Is Vulpix a rare one then? Am I just lucky? Like, well, what's going on here? Also, why are the symbols for the edit team red and blue? Because surely that means attack and HP. Is that supposed to, does it mean anything extra or not really? Do let me know. I assume everyone else is a bit more of an genius than me since I've had to wait to play this game. Waited all day for a, uh, I just realized where the exclamation mark was. Let me move to that again. Waited all day for a, 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 a state agent. They never showed up. Since when did I have a stutter? Okay, leveled up 10 times. I never realized I did, but okay. Yeah. Thank you. That's oh, just a normal type mushroom. Oh, that's not very interesting. That's a lot of challenges. Okay. We'll get around to him. No, we won't. Let's play. Finally. Watching a new play this is very aggravating. I'm sorry. But you were a noob once too, probably 24 hours ago. I'm speeding up, I know what I'm doing a little bit more. I think I get the, like, the general mechanics of this don't seem too complicated, like, you know. Like, I'm up close, well then Eevee does a takedown and does a lot more damage. And then, like, Pidgey's a bit more distant, so this gust will do great. Knocks two out in one hit, Meowth's got a little bit left, and Vulpix has an attack, which I forgot about because I keep assuming it's Rattata. I'm a pro, I tell ya. Let's try this out. Flame charge. Is it up close? It's just a it's just a projectile. And just once? Okay. Right, Pidgey is not quite in range. Flail for area of effect that completely missed. And Gust is way too far away. <laughs> nice. You might be right, I am a bit of a noob. Actually, takedown can take on multiple people, it looks like, so. What do I care? 
Very happy music. Get out of here, Rattata. Okay, so Vulpix charges up and then does a hit. Gotcha. Use me. I can never use Gust. Pidgey's way too close all the time. Actually, ah. Oh, perfect. Even better. See, could a pro do that? Probably. I did it entirely by mistake. Oh, this is. I, I thought Pidgey Vig, Vulpix was Eevee. Ah. See, now you got me overthinking everything. I'm sorry. I'm succeeding though, aren't I? Oh shoot. It's Rattata's older brother that's upset that I <laughs> didn't give him a chance. You can gust because you're kind of far away, Pidgey. They're all low on health. Oh, Pidgey got this. Charge up a bit. I think Eevee's dead. Eevee's become a... <laughs> become part poker cube. Eevee's almost back. So I'll just keep mashing attacks because I don't really think I've got much else of an option. And a gust, and you're going to be back any moment. Bam! Give it a moment. There we go. Lovely. That was flawless. Radicate might kick your ass, but not today. Almost did, though, I'll be honest. Okay, so we now have a slot. Fourth. Time to recover is less HP upon... Okay, that's a good stone. Imagine they start going crazy, like 302 is one of the stones in the future. Whoa. Your Pokemon, now your Pokemon up to level 5 can increase XP on expeditions. And we defeated that boss Pokemon, a statue that looked like a Pokemon was left behind. What in the world could it be? This is one of the symbols of the island, the prolific statue. I thought you had no data on this statue, robot guy, Moby4. Moby the statue was carved in the shape of three Rattata, a Pokemon that can flourish wherever it is. Perhaps this statue, this statue is meant to symbolize such prosperity. It seems you've explored, explored everything there is to explore in this area. I'll locate the route to the next area. May take some time to locate, so in the meantime... I've searched the database for information regarding the statue and found this that would appear to be something revered in a place called the Chamber of Legend. Nice. We've claimed it as our own with a flag. Whoa, choices in video games? But not really, because it's clearly a correct route with the numberings. Stand by. Route to the new area detected. Great. I'm gonna make some changes. Your best is 412 on power stones? My lord, that's a bit too much, don't you think? Feels like it to me, considering we're barely going with like 87 is big to us at the moment. Welcome back, Zoe. I don't know why the chat wasn't let you chat, but... Also, we've got a bunch more follows that I keep missing because my notifications are half silent, but not for all of them. We've got Shauna, thank you for the follow, Keza, and mine Dixie Wrecked. Nice one. I never fell for those before, but hey, you got it. Be sure to clip it. I'll make it a montage later. Actually, do people know about those? Damn it! It was the underscore. It threw me off. I was like, oh, I can't possibly be. It's Dixie Kong. Ah. My neck is... That's what you've done to me. That's apparently what my nervous antic is. <sighs> but no, really, I'm making montages of any good spits I get on streams. So, uh, you got a clip. I'll see it later, and I might put it in a montage on YouTube later. A move stone is a special item that can increase the performance of certain moves. You can put a move stone into a socket connected to a move that is the same color as the stone. Great. I don't know. Still don't know what to do with them, but all right. <laughs> uh, that's still throwing me off, man. I've seen montages of people falling for that kind of Twitch names. Here I am. Oh. Okay. It's only the hosts that have a sound a sound effect. Apparently. Thank you for this. The host Zoe. 
Actually, you guys can probably tell when I got a uh, notification better than I can, because you've got the full-on notification image. I don't. Oh well. Right, so we've now got a move stone, apparently. What does it do? Move... Move weightless. Weightless stone. So it's just... It's le Okay, 5% smaller. Okay. Between moves. We'll give it to Vulpix. Ah, oh, and that goes there. And there's only certain colours for it. Gotcha! This is piecing together. I don't want this on Vulpix. I keep thinking Vulpix is Eevee. Because they look kind of similar in their frames, don't they? I'm colorblind. I can't tell the difference in their skin tones. Uh, and this one can go to you. We have another one of these available? Okay. Who's got a slot? Have we got another slot for a power? Not on you. On Pidgey? No. That will still go... Well, we want it on somebody. Because it's really good. Well, Eevee died last time. So we'll give him extra HP recovery, shall we? This one is not as good. Yeah, that's just movement speed. Who needs that? Oh, I got the tickets to finish this now? Sure, I'll do it. Wow, is there always this much variety? I was expecting a thousand Rattatas at this point. We've got a Mr. Mime and an Execute. And you come with an extra challenge? Not quite sure what that means. Yeah, oh, you come with this. Oh, that was the one I didn't press. Oh, excuse me. Daz, give Volpix the thing you took off Eevee since it's better. Also, seriously, Daz, you spend tickets to finish something. Yeah, because I don't know how long I'm going to play this game, and I'm like, I'm going to jump on it. And now I've got an Execute and a Mr. Mime. Well, you know, how can I complain? Maybe they're really good. What kinds of Pokemon are attracted by your cooking, depending on your dish cooked? We know this. There are various dishes that you can cook, depending on how you combine your ingredients. You can check on the tendencies of Pokemon and the combinations of ingredients for the recipe menu. There are some hidden recipes that are especially appealing to certain Pokemon. Okay. I'm sure someone likes... So what all these are? Hmm. Whatever these are, cubes, fossils. I'm sure someone loves a pot full of fossils. Looks like a looks like a face at the moment. Looks like a robot head. Wow, I'm so I'm so creative and inventive. Look at this. Now it looks like a robot head with teeth or five eyeballs. Maybe it's a spider robot. Yeah, that's fine. They have five eyeballs, right? Not twenty-four. Okay, I want to edit my team and see how these guys look. That's a shiny execute! Actually, you're right, it is a weird colour, isn't it? I hadn't even, I hadn't even looked at it. <laughs> I'm so blind. This is another thing why I probably maybe have found shiny Pokemon in the past. I'm just too colourblind to tell half the time. I just assume that's what it looked like in this game. Mr. Mime is nearly 600 HP? Jesus, what is going on with me? Let me have a look at these. Um, it's not there. God damn it. I need to stop making this mistake. The yellow tone instead of a pink one. See, I knew that is the thing. You've got 144, you've got 500. That is insane. Okay. And this is level 11? I think I lucked out. Shoot me down for getting spending tickets, and then here's, here's, <laughs> here's these guys just showing up. Oh, I've got to say, these faces look kind of similar though, like Execute and Mr. Mimes. They, they, I'm going to get well confused well quick. Um, no, we've got to keep Eevee. We're putting these guys in, no question. Um, though, can I take out their things? Can I do that on Pokemon that aren't in my team? Hopefully. Um... Yes, I think I can. Pidgey, you do not have that stone anymore. Volpix, you never had anything. Well, that's sad. Switch back to our team. I wish to give you stuff. You've got one slot, and hopefully it's power. It is. Okay. You're only level three, so we'll give you movement speed, I guess? 
Why not? So you can be up in the fight a little bit. And then this can go to execute. No, I, no, it can't. That's fine. Who needs it? You know? Although this is even better, isn't it? Time to recover. No, I'm gonna keep it for Eevee. Could give it to Mr. Mime, but I'd rather not. You spent 15 pounds on this game so far? What on? Where do you buy, what do you buy? The, the PM tickets? The Pokemon tickets? People are freaking out about slow motion or slow mode in the chat. Sorry, I guess it got busy here. I, I can't do much about it. It's just what it does automatically and I generally like to, you know, let things go and run its course because otherwise I'll mess something up. Achieve a max of 500 HP. Thank you. <laughs> well, okay, that was a clear telling that I have got a shiny Pokemon. Uh, dude, I've just been given these by pure luck. I hope my five-eyed robot has something. God, yeah, that is that is pretty shiny, isn't it? Why did I not... Th I just assumed that's what it looked like in this game. I'm so dumb. I really am. Okay. Decorations. You can decorate your base camp. You can tap on the spot that's right size and set your direction there. The effect of decorations become active as soon as you get them and aren't affected by where you position them. Okay. Well, I'm going to put this right by the entrance where we see the wild Pokemon come in. Where do they come in from? That way, I think? There's not a slot there. Of course there isn't. Okay. Um, well, it's kind of ugly everywhere else. Why don't we put it over here, then? Magic. Oh, that puts it back. Okay. On its own little island. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Magic. I'll never see it again. I've got more quest stuff? Just for decorating. Okay. Thank you. We will do one more expedition and then I guess I'll finish that cooking. How long is that going to take? Oh, it's only going to take two. Never mind. So I guess that's why it was four, because they knew it was going to be better Pokemon afterwards? We've got 1,364 for practically no reason. Uh, bonus type fire. We don't have our Vulpix with us this time. And I don't plan to keep it. Grass. I'll go with this one. It's slightly faster. Yeah, we got a bonus type. 113. I saw that just then. It flicked from slow mode and followers mode and then turned off again. That's weird. Did a... I have no idea why. But, okay. Right, Mr. Mime has Substitute, which again doesn't do damage, I think. It just is extra defense, but... <laughs> which, I mean, I guess it's good that he's got extra um, mobility. We've got Sludge Bomb and Flash on this end. Okay. How does that go? I can't tell if that was a big attack or if it's just because people got bashed around. You can do some flailing. You can do some Flash. How does that go? Just hits that guy straight in front of you. Mr. Mime, you're a Substitute now. Oh, you shoot it ahead of you and do something. Okay. Interesting. Alright. I'm keeping an eye on these animations, seeing what's going on. Right, we've got two more slots left, but I don't know if that means... I guess that's the waves, and the waves might be multiple. If a Pokemon appears and it continues in that same uh, wave, is what I'm guessing. Alright, Mr. Mime just threw his substitute into the ocean. Or at least the river. This is very Minecrafty, actually. Like looking at that water, it's like undeniably Minecraft. Oh, it's like a poison explosion. That's cool. Hmm. What are the? Oh, those are crabs. I thought they were like very thin doduos or something. You can go there. Um, everything's bashing us back. Thingy's died again, and oh, I see the poker cube now. We got a stone, which is nice. I imagine these two are probably just going to end up carrying this whole game now. I can see that going on. Maybe. Evie, please come back soon. Do I have to tap you or anything? No, you can't do anything? Alright. Give that to you. Give you Sludge Bomb. It is actually getting... The thing is actually working. Nice. See, look, Evie can almost take down a, one of these... um. Goldine in one hit, but always is the one to die. I thought I gave it extra HP. 
since defense doesn't seem to matter in this game. <gasps> oh, slow bro. It's weird because I haven't actually got a lot of interaction with the first generation, ironically enough. All right, substitute. Not in the river. You were facing the wrong way. But I was going to say that was the perfect like range if only you were facing the correct direction. All right, e uh, Mr. Mime. Substitute. Way in the middle. Perfect. Then we got a sludge bomb. Do I have to like not attack while the substitute's out? Is that how that's the most effective? Eevee's dead. Shoot. Substitute, dude. Get out of here with that. Please attack the substitute. Yes! Execute is saved. Low bro is still going to be an issue though. Oh my god, we got multiple? Oh, maybe not. Uh, Eevee is almost down already and missed on the flail. All right, I'm just going to substitute as much as possible on the uh, on the opposite sides. I'll attack when I can. All right, go for substitute. Yes, beautiful. This is one that turned out really well. Uh, Takedowns, much more effective. Substitute, get distracted, turn around. Sorted. It's not like Minecraft, but the graphics are like Minecraft. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like The water very much just makes me think Minecraft. And Eevee's dead again. But they still get experience, so that's fine. Ooh, what's this? Power? Great. Oh, you've got a... you've got a... You didn't always have that, did you? Did you earn it just then? Sharing stone, plus effect for buddies. Stone... And just both stones. Okay. I think Eevee is targeting more because it's in the lead? Oh, I might change that then. Um, hold on. I'm going back to the base camp just to make sure, because I went into edit team earlier and it wouldn't let me do everything. Again, though, it might just be me being bad at the game. So, Eevee, go back. Execute up front? Who's... No, who's got the best... Um, neither of them have best defense. Mr. Mime would go up front, because he's got the most HP. And then... Uh, I guess Eevee wants to be on our... Uh, Six and eleven. Uh, that's just that's just the levels. I imagine that's one, two, and three actually. So we'll put Eevee on the bottom. Go to that. Go to power charms and sort some things out. Oh my lord, we got a lot. What's this? Sharing stone. We'll give that to Mr. Mime. Uh, I assume nothing's died. But we're fine. As I heard my computer make a sound that it usually makes when it dies. It just goes meep, meep, even. Right, this is Mr. Mime, so we'll give him Sharing Stone. Nope. This move stone doesn't affect that move. Ah, we haven't got the right colour for it. Okay, I'll come back to that then. We have a power slot. I have a 90 plus 4. Yeah, yeah, this one. This one's for Mr. Mime. He doesn't need more motion speed. In fact, I don't actually want him to have speed boost. I can. Because that means he's too close with the substitutes. I think. Actually, no, he's supposed to be a long-range guy, isn't he? Is he long-range? He is... Da -da 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 -da. Bingo. Psychic moves weight, resistance down on effects, psychic type moves weight, okay. Does it say what, like, what his range is? Not really. Okay. I imagine, because I, I guess if I, if I do have him faster, then he's more in position all the time. Now he's got 300, and that's very tempting. You know what, I might just leave it as that. We'll go with it. Uh, right, this guy, wait, what's this? Oh, that's your moves. That's your moves! Oh, but then that just slows, so what, that replace, oh, that's your other move. Gotcha. Right. Okay. We just need to find something compatible with this later. Right, okay. Execute. You've got plenty of spots. Okay, so this is Sludge Bomb. This blows over when it hits the ground, damaging surrounding enemies, sometimes poison enemies. Great. And this is more effects for buddies. It just makes it good? Oh, I thought that colour matched. Is that not this colour? Oh, yeah, because that's pink and this is cyan, right? So we need a like a focus energy kind of attack for that. Okay. Not going to happen. But, oh, well, we can dream. 244, I will take that. Very nicely. <sighs> I think that's as good. Keep checking, checking back on the chat, seeing if anything's changed, but I think we're all right.
Now I've realised about that old Twitch name that I accidentally where I read out when I shouldn't have really read it out. It got a grammatical error. It says mine. Why is it not my? I would have fallen for it then, that's probably why. <sighs> oh well. No one seemed to react anyway, so maybe nobody noticed until I kept talking about it. What do I know? Let's get back in! I am thirsty and I've finished already my first can of iron brew. <laughs> but I tell you what, it's working! I feel I feel a lot better about my my performance today. I'm actually talking, which is nice. I mean I talked last time, but Ah well you can still see the old stream. You know what I'm you know what I mean. After this, go check out my stream from yesterday. I played some Sonic Heroes and just listen to the difference in my voice. You'll be able to tell what I'm talking about. Just a little bit. It might also help that I'm not actually wearing headphones this time, because of my setup's slightly different. I just hit my own substitute. I'm a real I'm a real pro at this. Um it might be because like because I'm playing this game on a TV that has to play out loud and I'm not playing on my PC where I've got headphones in, it's making me talk different. I ain't got a clue. Oh well. Still kinda quiet actually. Not as loud as I usually am, but even then I don't need to be. I've also got the volume nice and loud on my microphone. I still cannot tell what that ding's reminding me Oh, it might be reminding me of Nintendo Land. When you get a coin, or when, yeah, when you get a coin through the mini game. Like, it's, it's like a game of pachinko or something like that. And it's like when you get the coin through the circle and you need to get it all the circles in to beat the round. Bye bye, Eevee. Um, still, they're just attacking that one. Maybe it's because it's the only close range one or something? I have not a clue. Oh, it's, it's re aggroed onto execute. There's another substitute for you, buddy. Actually, water is good against uh, poison, I think. Let me reverse that. Like this. I think that's still defense. Put defense on it. Alright, substitute. Get off EV. Thank you. More substitute. Tentacle is fooled. I think I'm... No, I was going to say, I think I'm doing okay, but Eevee is way past dead. Maybe I should switch out away from Eevee. Because Eevee's not doing great. We'll come back to it, maybe? I don't know. How do I, how should I go about this? Because logically I'd get rid of Eevee. Because it's not going too great for him. But then Eevee's the starter and we need to get it evolved, you know? Also, Eevee's only back at like a quarter health. Can I heal during games? Probably not. Poison is less effective against water, yeah, but then so was Flash, I'm pretty sure. Flash didn't seem to have a, the defense icon as well, but I could be wrong. Back forth brook, it was cool. Nice. All sorts of jellies and blobs. Eevee's your only close range attacker, so it will be attacked the most. Yeah. So would it be better if I do switch him out? Right, up next, let's let's check this. Uh, fine, the quests first. Great, we got power stones. Thank you. Get in here. Grey porridge a la cube. Favourite food of greyish Pokemon. So I'm expecting a Metagross. Not even this generation. Like a Dolphan? What is that one? I don't know that one. Looks like a tortoise. Oh, it's, it's Rhyhorn. That seems way too advanced for me. It's got th it's got four sections and two moves. Are they just giving me all the fun ones because they know I'm not gonna like play for long or something. Not that I've confirmed that I am or not, but still. What's going on with you? Okay, well, we've got, we can finally use those heart stones that I've been wanting to use. Do you have this? No, you don't. No, you do not. 
Um, is it any good? I can't actually tell. It's level 10, which is quite nice. But it's just kind of an all-rounder. What are its what are its moves? Stomp. A normal type move. <laughs> Excuse me. Use a stomps on enemies in front of itself with a big foot, damaging them. Okay. 180 damage and 189. The user slams into enemies in front of it with a reckless full body charge, damaging all enemies. You know what? This sounds like an Eevee replacement. So I'm gonna treat it as such, I think. Can I go back? Oh, okay, that moves that back. Okay, never mind. Put that on you. Extra health. You've now got, what, 236. And, uh... Eevee over here has got 167. Yeah, we'll, we'll give you a little a little break. So Rhyhorn can come in, even though you just look like an angry Bulbasaur in your symbol. What do I know? Oh, actually, on to that. There's something I want to check. There's a, there's a training button. I want to know if I can train another Pokemon, because if I can change my Eevee, I can also get um, a challenge thing, which will be nice. By training your Pokemon, you can increase their EXP or change the moves they know. You'll need the help of a supporting Pokemon to train one of your Pokemon. You'll have to say goodbye to the supporting Pokemon once training is over. Oh. That's horrifying. Okay. You can have four? But I've got no duplicates. I... I think it might be Rattata. I might get rid of Rattata for it then. See how it goes. So. Training. We got that. Rattata. Can a level 4 do it? We'll take it to that. Ah, oh, damn. Pidgey. You're pretty basic and generic. There we go. Get us to level 8. Get us to a bit more than level 8. Might be the best we can do. Volpix, I'm keeping you around. But I'm not too fussed about these normal ones. Wait, first things first. Uh, Pikmin, uh, Pokemon can. Not yet. That's definitely Rattata. That's definitely Pidgey. Okay. Doing it. Wait, did she just defeat them? I looked away. It, but that was amazingly quick. Did she just go bang, bang and just killed them for like a sacrifice? That's cruel. Alright, well we'll come back to that later. You're right, Mr. Mime hasn't looked scary. He's like coming out with his hands all stuck up and all that. Ugh. I mean, I guess he's already done that, but he's not like moving them like he's stuck in a block. He's just like running at you. Like, look, Evie looks like she's running for her life. He's like, <laughs> like seriously, that's horrible. Level up training, thank you. Oh, have I got another cooking thing going? I don't think I have. Right, so. Rhyhorn loves fossils. Now we know. Um, let's give it rocks, icy rocks, and big roots. I don't want to give it any. Um, ooh, honey. We could get a bug type, I imagine, or an ice. I want an icy, icy thing. Damn, that does use three. Um, yeah, maybe this will keep with the uh, the icy theme as opposed to contaminating it with some roots. Although, again, I can't tell if it told me the recipe up there. Okay, and we've got plenty of PM tickets. We've got like 95, well, now 55. Give me something good. Stone soup a la cube, great for rock type Pikmin. Let's not have another Rhyhorn, otherwise he's just gonna go into training. <gasps> it's an Onyx! Oh my God, are they seriously this? Readily available? I'm getting a new one every time, and I love Onyx. Onyx is like my favorite Pokemon from Gen 1, because how can it not be? I have a Power Stone on Eevee, you are correct. I will take that off him as well. I've got two. Give him to Rhyhorn, I might give him to Onyx, you know, we'll see. What's going on here? Bloody hell, am I being lucky then? Is this a lucky thing, or is this normal? He definitely looks iconic. <gasps> oh my god. I sound like some kind of mini child. He's pretty good. 600 HP on that front. He's not quite on Mr. Mime's level. He's got way less attack, so he's more HP than everything. Probably want to replace him with Execute. Probably. Which is a bit of a shame. What does he do? What are your moves? What can you do, Mr. Duke? You weren't on, 
upon expecting this. Okay, steel type move. Wonderful. User focuses all of its light energy into a single point and fires a beam in front of itself, raising some concentrating the amount of attack, a, amount of damage they take. Nice. Roar. The user roars intensely, blowing away surrounding enemies. And it's got loads of HP stuff. Hmm. I think I have to throw them in. I don't have a lot of choice not to, you know. Um. Do I have to? Do I want to replace execute though? Maybe I'll replace right horn. We have more variety actually if we get rid of right horn. Does right horn have stuff? He does. He has a power charm. So I'll take back this. Come out of that and put right horn back for now. He'll be back, I'm sure. I did pay PM again. It doesn't cost me actual money, it gives it for free. It's like Animal Crossing tickets, I'm fine. Let me worry about these problems. Okay, that does just replace it. Now I know. 778 HP, you know what? I'm happy with that. We'll keep going, is there any more? Actually, we ain't even got any more HP. Okay. We got enough for a pa no. Four things never gonna get anywhere, is it? Ooh. Is you have one of those? Comp is your move compatible with this? No, no. You still, you still ain't. Whoa. My Joy-Con is making issues now that I put it under the desk. Nope. Nope. Okay. Enough delays. Let's continue playing. I feel that playing. This is actually a lot of fun. You have a chance to change moves in training if you go to the move one. Okay. I'll have a look at that next time. Uh, we have a total of 2,112 attack. I think we can handle level 3. Mr. Mime can take the Power Stone because it's better than the one if it's the other ones. I'll have to reread that later. Right, Onyx, what do you do? You bite. Good to know. Uh, let's get rid of these mini ones. It just pushes them away? Oh, okay. Uh, Mr. Mime, you don't need the distraction, but we'll give it to you anyway. Get rid of that whirly whirl with that one. Flash cannon. How does that look? That doesn't even look like. It doesn't even look like a any move. It just looks like water more than anything. But all right. Um, can I roll you into the river? I cannot. Okay, let's get a substitute in there and a bomb going on. And then a flash cannon of water. Well, maybe that's not water. It looks a little less watery now. The trees are very Minecrafty, actually. I'm, I'm seeing all the little connections to Minecraft because Minecraft's a lot more pixelated and square, as this is a lot more rounded and nice. Never really played Minecraft with mods before. Never played much of Minecraft in general. Oh well. Where is execute? There he is. <laughs> the the bomb told me. Very convenient. Okay, another substitute for you. A sludge bomb for the poly whirl. How far does this flash cannon go? It's in death. Oh no, no, it disappeared for a moment. Okay, and it definitely didn't look like water then, but it didn't look like steel either. Just like a kind of like a poison. It more, yeah, it looked like a poison beam. Or what I'd imagine a poison beam to look like. Explosion for you, and a flash cannon. You have way too much HP for your own good. Here's a distraction. Here's another bomb. Thank you. Power stone nobody has is better than the one on Mr. Mime's current stones. Ah, okay. What happened there? I don't quite know what... Was that confusion? Oh, well. What's the point of roar? Is it just to make some distance if someone's getting hurt? I guess that makes sense. Thank you for the for the the jet the honey. That's honey. I think I remember that being. Get some distance. Doesn't do anything major, but okay. Substitute to get you a little confused. Right. Long range beam! It barely did anything. Nice. Actually, I haven't been using flash. I probably should. In a moment. One more hit will take this guy down. Lovely. <gasps> I've forgotten that one. Goldark. Okay. It, I thought it was something else. 
that's probably from another generation, whatever I was thinking of. I still don't know his name, so oh well. Golduck it is. Um, what does Flash do again? Is it direct? Increased its defense and attack? Or I don't think that did it. What to shoot, please? Nope, it went right in the river. Seems to be the only thing that goes in the river. We've lost Mr. Mime. Mr. HD buff is gone. We have no more substitutes, so it's just a full-on attack it now while while Mr. Mime slowly recovers. I didn't start my cooking. Oh, everything's going wrong. Oh, I did. What did I? No, you're right. I didn't because I put in another one straight away. Oh, well, we'll get back to it. Substitute us, please. You are our defense HP guy, Mr. Mime. It's your job to keep the guys distracted as main leader who's going to get hit the most. Is that a bad decision on my part? But my strategy? I guess not because losing the distraction guy is the least of our worries, you know? Nice! Nice. I don't look when the leveling up goes on, so I keep missing what's actually changed, but oh well. We've almost been live for an hour. Went by quick. Doesn't feel like it. Oh, maybe a little bit. Hmm. I've been playing a while, I guess. Right. Cooking. Let's actually get this going, shall we? I want a giant pack of... Damn it, there's nothing too crazy in here. Let's use these big roots this time, sure. There's only one. I'm sure that's fine. Um, we'll go over the soft ingredients this time, so I don't get another rock Pokemon. Hopefully. How long is that going to take? Another four? It's another four. Of course it is. Well then, I'll get some PM tickets and I'll spend them. Because I can do what I wish. It's like I'm, there's an abundance of them. Don't need to play the long game, you know? It takes four, I'm not going to waste my time. And I'll get another cooking thing going after this. Give me another shiny. Or not, I don't mind. Blue soda a la cube. Favourite food of bluish Pokemon. I don't think we've got a blue one yet. We never got that Squirtle. We'll see. Alright. Seems nice. Squishy, but you know, nice. Level 9. Got a handful of things. Two moves. Great. And I'll switch out that Mr. Mime thing in a moment. First, let me plug this in. Um... Use some honey this time, sure. And the generic mushrooms this time. Oops. No. There we are. I'll let you go. Now then, Mr. Mime. Is this a game that is also being made for mobile? It is, yes. You can play it entirely on your touchscreen on your Nintendo Switch and presumably mobile, I think. Is it out now on mobile, or is it going to be? That's the one I don't actually know. Um, so what's the... You said this guy's got already a power stone. It doesn't. Was it, was it another Pokemon? Or are you saying this needs to be changed? No? No, not really. Maybe it was another another Pokemon? Onyx, maybe? No, I, I, have, I, am, I am dumb and I've forgotten it. Or I'm, I'm thinking of move stones. Oh, nope, that's a move. It's not a move stone. Um, let me just see if there's anything better. Okay, so there's this here. Oh, actually, we just got another one of these. Execute did not die last time. Mr. Mime did. Has he got slots for this? He doesn't. Okay, never mind. Um, 66 and 84 are still lower. Oh, actually, no, this could be higher. Sure, I'll swap these out. Lovely. Onyx has more HP slots. Beautiful. Purple is a mix of red and blue. That's something else. Um, I meant Mr. Mine. The silvery, the silvery one in the top right is better than the one in the middle. Is it right, Mr. Mine? The silvery. Oh, oops! I guess I pressed the wrong button. The joys of not actually being able to see my cursor sometimes. How did I backslide out? Was I pressing the wrong button? That was probably exactly what went happen there. So, Mr. Mime, 
slippery one in the right, then the top right is diff better than the one in the middle. Oh, you already I already did it. Okay. Never mind. Next time I use my PM, I'll get something stupid OP. We'll see next time. It'll be not this cooking time, the one after. Oh, well, there's four again. Whenever we get enough, how much does it take? 40. When we get 40 PM, we'll use it. We'll see where it goes. Bada -bada -bada. Check out move training. Okay. We'll do something new every round. Uh, where was that? Was I an edit team? Yes. Training. What would I want to change? I don't know. Move learning. I see. The Pokemon's moves may change randomly. Press and hold the icon to see its description. What's what's going on with you? Just that you're new. Okay. Um, what do I want to change? Who needs difference? You ain't got... Mm, I guess Rhyhorn's probably next. And you've just got... you got Stomp and something. Mm, decisions, decisions. We'll probably bring back Eevee. What did Eevee have? They had Takedown and Flail. Sure. We'll give them something different then. And in, oh, that means we have to sacrifice something. Horsey, I'm sorry. You just showed up. There's not a lot of success rate though. Like even if I put all my other Pokemon into this, I'm not going to. That's still not even halfway. We'll come back to this. We'll get a few more Pokemon. I'll do more cooking. And we'll do it. Ah, see you later, Penguin Dude. Also, thank you, Quim, for the follow. It was 21 minutes ago. But hey, at least I, I found it eventually. This whole thing will likely be on YouTube if I don't get blocked worldwide like Nintendo likes to do to me these days. Um, so then you'll get to also see your notification then. Not that you, if you've already gone, then you won't, but you know what I mean. Oh, that makes sense. Um, is everything looking all right on stream? Just to check, because it's been a while. I you know, I'm more... D <laughs> Naturally, I'm just playing the game more than anything, so I don't actually know if anything's gone wrong. Let me know if something has, but I think I'm alright. Oh, I'm a little heated. This room's really hot. <laughs> the window's shut. My fan isn't on, my computer's whirring, and the sun is always in this room. My, I'm in one of those rooms where it's always facing the sun. Lovely angles. What direction is this? West. I keep looking, my room faces west. Or the window does. I think. Yes. Shut my eyes to imagine the map then. Everything looking alright? Everything looks good to me? You gotta go, so bye. See you later, Pikmin Master. Have a good one. I'll be here for a few hours and then hopefully tomorrow as well. Um, we'll have to see. I haven't finished my Daz Reviews videos, which are supposed to come out tomorrow. It's supposed to be two coming out 6 pm UK time. Um, uh, since I'm delayed and this stream has been delayed, so that's also delayed. I might not have. Might be streaming later in the day, which actually, you yeah, know, that's fine. I might just stream in the evening. I was thinking of doing that. I've got more availabilities in my times at the moment. So I like the idea, mostly because I'm, I'm streaming while I'm not home alone, which changes everything. Um, so hopefully I can do more evening streams. More American people can see it, because the time zones actually line up nicely. And, um, I don't know. Hopefully I can just get more stuff out. So even when I'm late, I'm always about, you know? Like today, usually like with streams I've had to run on a time limit, it's like I can only stream for four hours, I can only stream for eight, after that someone's coming home and I've got to stop, or something like that. But now it's like, they're already home, so I can go on as long as I want to. It's me At this point it's a matter of if I want to go to bed, or when do I want to stop so I can do Daz reviews today, you know? So I've got more time to play, which should be good because it needs more content for everyone. Also reminds me that uh, I put a poll up on Twitter about... um. Let's play long videos, like lengths and all that. I've got to check out the answers for that and make some things out of it. Hello, Dom is boss. You, got, you see my you see my shiny execute. Does it interest you? It looks like fireballs. Now that I think about it. Or moldy eggs. Everyone loves them. <gasps> oh, I just realized something. I'm so slow and dumb. The shininess will linger when it evolves. What level does execute evolve at? When does it become executor? And... I assume it's not going to be the Alolan region. No, that was Let's Go, the Pokemon games that had Alolan Pokemon, I think. No, it was in Pokemon Go? Which means it might be this game? Oh, I don't know. I'll check that it hasn't got an Everstone. I want to see a, a shiny, um, what's it, face? Executor. That's the one. 
or golden nuggets or golden eggs, yeah. They're just giant egg yolks. It's with a leaf stone. Ah, oh, shoot. I assume there are leaf Oh, hello, Cloyster. I assume there are leaf stones in this game. Mr. Mime is almost dead. Can I save Mr. Mime? You're going to need to put out all the, all the substitutes you can, dude. And Onyx is doing fine. Where's... Where's our other guy? Where's 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 poison guy? Vanished? Is he dead? Oh, he's just way over there. Okay. This cloister is gonna take ages to die. I can tell now. Like, look how much HP he's got. Oh no, we just never hit him. Excuse me, I'm a dumb. Yeah, this Mr. Mime ain't surviving very long. Mr. Mime, do what you can. Substitute as much as you can. If he... Yeah, no, we won't do a roar yet. Oh, you're right on top of them. Substitute, dude. Ah, oh, he got it out. He got it out. Okay. Um, You guys can get away from everyone else. Or just you guy. Blood Bomb would be great for general. Okay, we'll just keep roaring. Keep him distant. And then explode on the side with the poison. Lovely. Uh, how... Oh, Mr. Mime's almost back. Even better. All right, distance on you. Substitute. Put you there. Nice, you're right on top of the substitute. Get on the substitute. It did nothing. Is the substitute making noise? Well, it's working on the cloister either way, so I'm not going to play. I think we're doing okay. This is going well. Wow, substitute comes back way quick, doesn't it? Yeah, look at that. Look at that thing. Nothing else is relevant. It's all in your imagination. The substitute's calling you bad names. It's insulting your mother. It's it's making a pun on your name. Wow, you're a real... I can't think of a name that insults it. What's a pun on Cloyster? Someone give me a pun on Cloyster in the background. Yeah, the substitute strat OP. I'm going with it. It works, man. Everyone's low anyway. So, we give the roar to give it distance, the substitute to give it a distraction right by where its roar is. There we go, it turns its back, roar from behind, it's almost down, give it another substitute, roar to get away from us all, it does nothing because it's stuck on that piece of land. Look at the substitute, that's all that matters right now, okay? Does the roar actually stop them attacking? Like, even though it's in range, will it stop? It worked, and Mr. Mine was dead anyway, but okay. The world is your cloister! Or I guess the world isn't your cloister. Uh... We tried. Ooh, scatter shot. Move number of shots plus one. Move attack minus... Okay, so it's less damage, but it does more. Your, your puns aren't, aren't too great. Yeah, I mean, I guess cloister is already a pun, but... Yellow button, right next to, right above Onyx, makes your pick, uh, Pokemon run away for a bit. Okay. I was wondering, because I saw it for a moment, but it doesn't, just makes them distant. It doesn't change much. They still are in the attack, but, oh well. Okay. Range team, thank you. Water in type investigation. Oh, defeat 50 water types. Gotcha. Let's get out of here. So, we've got, we've still got 25 PMs? Oh, because I only got... I, uh, ingredients. Right. We might have to do a bit more waiting than I assumed. Right. Uh, I'm on the wrong bit. No, I'm not. I just have to press that to get the power chain. Oh. Okay. So, we have these two. That's pink. We have a pink slot. Beautiful. And we've got some damage stuff. Oops. I would like these off. Thank you very much. I want to execute to evolve. That's priority number one. Uh, so you have a pink slot, which is effect for buddies. Just in for for what bit though? I just roar. No, yeah, that doesn't fit because I'm looking at the wrong color. That's why. But that will do multiple, but not as good. Multiple roars. That will do multiple beams. Uh, what's what's execute to move? Oh, that's poison sludge. Well, I don't think it's good enough. What's its other move? I've forgotten. It's Flash, which we're not too interested in. I'd rather double up the uh, beam. I think. I quite like that. Double up its beam. And we'll go to Execute and work on its power. If we can. We cannot. 
Of course we cannot. Anyone got a power slot? No? Okay. What are we going with then? This game is actually pretty fun. You're right, Mr. Commenter. Who was that? Dom. Yeah. Pretty is. I'm actually quite enjoying this. Oh, I put it on raw, not beam. Hold on. I'm a smart. I'm not good with these kind of symbols. Like that? No, I mean, I... I'll tell you why. Because I assumed this is pink and this is like cyan grey. So I was like, oh, this is the pink one. This is the cyan grey one. So it only goes on the left one. I'm dumb. No, I did an IQ test once, and uh, I got a really good score, not bragging, but they said that my specialty was like shapes and like geometry, like on part what, part of the section. This was like in like year seven, so probably not as relevant anymore, but uh, clearly the case, because I can't seem to recognize basic icon symbols, or I'm just rushing it. Right, this boss is still above us? My lord. Okay. Well, we gotta go with it. We'll use that. Uh, we'll use that substitute OP strat. And while I'm here, I'm gonna. Uh, I also whipped out some chocolates to give myself some energy. They are very squeaky. I'm gonna leave it down for now. Um, this will be part of the strat. Is the chocolate strat? You gotta try and eat chocolate, unravel it, and all that at the same time as. Oh, look at that beautiful double move at the same time as fighting. Okay, slug bomb for you. Rip out the galaxy bar. Lovely. Okay, and we're still good to go. Look at this double shot, though. Actually, this is probably going to miss completely. Oh, no, it hit one of them. Or what? Hit. One, one hit. I'm so frantic, man. I can't speak. Like, this isn't even, like, a high... Good job, Onyx. It's not even, like, a super high action f battle game, but I'm, like, just fancying myself up about it. I don't know why. It's... I guess it's because it's real-time fighting. We don't get that in Pokemon usually, right? Oh, that's so good. I mean, I know there's less damage. It's like 15% less damage, or just 15 less damage, but that's still pretty good. It hits everyone. Okay, nice. More power. Which we can't use because we haven't got a power slot, but okay. Hopefully someone will level up to it no soon. And this guy, I don't even need to move, use a move, do I? No, <laughs> not at all. Oh, you did four damage to my execute, and goodbye. Hello, you. You seem like a minor threat. Have a substitute. Turn around. Look at that. Oh, look. It's a. Uh, it's. It's right there. It's just looking out in the ocean side. How dare it? Be sure to attack it now. Uh, flash cannon. Actually, yes. We'll hit both of them. It's right nearby. Not if you bash them away. Noted. And the bomb completely missed. These guys are not in sync. Oh, add flail. That actually did a bit of damage. Mr. Mime, how have you lost so much HP? Don't you have like tons? Have you lost like 300 HP? What are you doing? Because you're in the lead again? Come on, man. Thank you. Get out of here with your flails, your bombs, have some substitutes, get distracted. I need to work out like the timings on these moves. Because then I can like sync them up perfectly. That would be a lot of fun. I also need to stop spamming substitute because they're working perfectly fine without it. Oh, Pokemon appeared! Okay, Substitute, you can stick around for a while. Let's roll him, hopefully, so that he looks at the Substitute. He did not. He's not distracted by it at all. The moment I pressed another Substitute, he got distracted. Okay. Wow, he's not distracted for very long, is he? He's a smart one. This guy. <laughs> Onyx took him down. I am fighting the boss, and I am weaker than it, but I... It's still possible, right? It, like, you can defeat the odds. That's what the whole Pokemon anime is about, right? <laughs> kind of. Like, you don't evolve Pikachu and he still does fine. I think I should, I should be alright. Like, it's just going to be a bit of an extra challenge, but... I've got the pro strat ever. I've got this substitute strat. Just keep spamming out substitutes and then they'll, they'll always not attack you. Apart from the times when they do. Get a bomb in there. And then if they get too close, like that guy is... It didn't affect the guy that's actually worrying me, but oh well. Actually, it's Mr. Mime. He'll be fine. He comes back well quick, I think. Bam. Actually, yeah. Is it possible to get hit by both of Onyx's uh, flash cannon? Because if that's the case, then we're doing more damage because then you're doing double the attack, and it's just minus 30 of the normal damage. 
But still, you know, I think that works out. Okay. This is the boss, Polyrath. We've got a lower mime, a full Onyx. And everything else, we're hoping mine up. Get out of here, please. Is anyone distracted by... Yes, they are distracted by the substitute. See? It successfully works. They're all so distracted by it. Right. Flash cannon on you. The substitute is gone, so let's throw in another. I'll wait until... Yeah, okay. So up to this point, I've just been spamming out substitutes. Now I'm just going to do it till when it actually disappears. Like it's just dis... Oh, no, it hasn't. Right. Raw, put them on it. And then like that. And Mr. Mime's gone the moment we need the, uh, the actual <laughs> substitute. Beautiful. Just how I wanted things to go. Right, we'll do a raw soon. Mr. Mime's half back. We're okay. Sludge bomb for you guys. A raw to get you guys away from execute. Thank you. Mr. Mime is very nearly back. Sludge bomb. Substitute. There we go. Our prayers have been answered. That guy's at least near the substitute. The other guys are miles away, but I'm sure that's okay. He's about to be gone. You guys are going to get away from me. <laughs> only the one... Is it only straight in front of you then? I guess it must be. Shoot. Sludge bomb. Bam. Okay. Is Polyrath gone? No, Onyx is just finding it by himself. Polywell is about to be gone, thank you. Just Polyrath. Give him, give him, give him the substitute. And double attack on that. Hopefully that actually counted as a double attack. Poison missed, that's an interesting explosion. Right. Oh, substitute, it's behind you now. Look at it. Ain't it great? Work on it. Take it down. Oof, my lord. That's two of us down already. Okay, we're going to roar you away for a while. Um, Mr. Mime's almost back. That, that missed. That just missed. Oh my god, this might be working, dude. Like, look at that. I'm dodging the explosions. He's not getting close until I'm locked in with him. Right, run away for a moment. Substitute. This might be really close, considering he's only at half health, actually. Run away. For a moment. Okay. Can I heal? I guess that's not an option, yeah? Alright, Onyx is down now. Unsurprising, really. Right, we're gonna have to just substitute. This might be a real tough battle. I'm gonna wait for everyone to come back a bit. I think he destroyed the substitute. He did. Run away. Get away from that. Onyx, why are you back with so little health? How is that helpful to anyone? Execute, you're also just about to die. Anyone got any suggestions here? Alright, Onyx is down already. The substitute is out. Just stall for Onyx while well, he's down again. <laughs> Can Onyx do much? Has he just got to keep roaring, I guess? There you go, I gave you a buddy. Don't blame me, I'm, he's just a buddy for you. Get out of there, Execute. You don't want to be there right now. Right, roar him. Uh, Onyx, why did you appear immediately aggro and then disappear again? How's that helping anyone? Right, Mr. Mime, you are not allowed to die here. Okay. Execute with your one HP. Please just, like he's almost down. He is legitimately, run Execute. My lord! He is actually almost down. Stop running for him, Execute. You are going to die. Um, Execute's back. Onyx about to come back even. Lovely. Roar! And okay, good job, Onyx. You helped. To the, you really saved the world there, buddy. Substitute. You're down too. Alright, we'll just... Ugh. Execute was too roaring for a fight there. He was a real boiled egg. Collect items and give up 10 of those? Yeah, I mean, I don't really have a slot for them. Like, none of them are really going to go that far. <sighs> Thank you, Fang, for those notifications on deaths. We got 18 of them. We're at 18 now. Onyx just popped in and exploded. He sure did. Okay. Let's change up some things. 
I don't know what... Well, okay. We got another... Okay, that's, that is a... Oh, because we got one? We got... Because we got a scatter shot stone, or I guess because we used it, we got another upgrade thing. Interesting. Okay. Um, let's look at these power charms and see if there's any more I can do. So yes, we can. We got lots of power stuff. Mr. Mime, you're not one for attack. So why have I given you attack stuff? Oh well. You also don't have attack. I need more attack. That is my thing. Like, he's got very little attack and he's using powers. Pop, like, sludges all the time. So I should probably swap him out. It's nice that he's there, but he's not relevant right now. I think. So execute, you can go back. We want someone who can do a bit more damage. You've got... Uh, what is what is he? What, what were we just attacking? What, dying by? What was that? I've already forgotten it. Mr. Mime can have more health now? Maybe I should have a crack at the other area? No, i got to finish it. Um... Okay, well, either way, they're both like normal type moves. You're a higher level. You've got more stuff in general. Rhyhorn, you're gonna come in here. I've decided. Even though Execute's probably way higher level, but oh well. Okay. Now, we'll give you that. Makes us generally a bit more powerful. Uh, ba ba Someone else said something else. Mr. Mime can have more health. That was it. How so? Because he just has that slot. Well, Onyx has lots. But I guess, yeah, we do want... Hmm. Because Onyx... Better off at a distance. So we're here. Can I take this... Give that to him? I can. That's that easy? Alright. Um, now Onyx, you're a little behind. Slightly. But you're fine. You got 166 boost anyway. You're more than happy. Should be. Okay. How else are we going to do this? We're going to camp and get more Pokemon. That's what we're going to do. If we can. Ah, oh, we still don't have enough. PM tickets. I'm not going to buy any. Um, so let's have a look at this. Elite. It was Polyrath. Yeah, we don't have anything against it. Okay. Um... You'll get PM tickets you can use right away as a bonus. Great. So what, these are just things I can buy. They'll make things more efficient. Decorations have special effects that activate automatically when you purchase them. You can also decorate your base camp with them by tapping the decoration. Okay. Like, what do I do with this? This Evolve Eevee? What does it do? Oh, it just increases ingredient drops. Okay. Cool. What else we got? A lot, actually. Ooh, Mew Mewtwo arc. Maximum battery charge at plus one. Interesting. Pikachu has never looked more horrifying. Nor has Doduo. My lord. Box expansions. Oh, oh, yeah. We're gonna have to deal with inventory soon. Ugh. Okay. Is there any more I can do? Yes. I can I can train somebody. Uh, who's mine? You're lacking on moves. Not that you've got much. Uh, we probably just need you to level up. Who do I want more leveled? I. You want someone who's nearly got? Hold on, let me look at these again. If I level them up, they'll get more power slots. Well, this guy doesn't need any right now. Well, he's not getting any, because he's not leveled up, I guess. You're not close either. Rhyhorn, how are you doing? You're not either. Okay, great. <laughs> oh. Execute. Where are you? There you are. You've already got a power charm, which I need to take off you for a start. And you've almost got a power slot. But it probably won't do too much, because we've only got that one anyway. So let me take this off you. And someone's got plenty of heart stuff, I think. Right. I feel like someone does. Hopefully it's Mr. Mime. <laughs> he needs even more. No, it wasn't him. Onyx? Yes, Onyx has loads of HP stuff and not enough attack, which is very backwards for him. Beautiful. That might make us do better. Upgrade my boxes? But why? I've got plenty of space, don't I?
You know, you can do one more mission, and I think it costs 20 tickets now to get a new Pokemon. Oh, okay. I need to do one more expedition, okay. See you later, Dom. Have a good one, wherever you're going. I'll see you later in the future. Also, again, I'm always 20 minutes late on this, but Ice Phoenix has followed. Thank you for the follow. You've probably either long gone or you're very much involved with this already, so I apologize for my delay. Why did I go back into this camp automatically? That was not what I wanted to do. I was trying to open up a chocolate bar and it ruined me. Where's my thingy? There it is. Go to the boss. We're trying again. We're just slightly above him now. So let's see where this goes. Mm. Right. I'm going to throw out substitutes as much as I can. Sorry, I'm eating a tiny section of a chocolate bar. So, Mr. Mime, get out there with that substitute. I don't want to hit anyone. I don't want to get any more damage. Whoa! I thought that was Sludge Bomb. That is very clearly not. This is great. Look at that. Lovely. Okay. And we've got the classic consistent takedown as well. Oh, that's beautiful. Start them in with a substitute and then get them with the close range uh, stomp right up front. Then we've got that for you. You are a long range enemy, so we'll get you way up close. Or, uh, or we can already lose Rhyhorn. That's a very good sign. Yes. Don't worry, Pikmin Master. I'm on. I'm on. I'm in the know. Um, I plan to probably. I'll probably what I'll end up doing. Um, if I cut these uh, streams into chunks, well, for YouTube, um, which we'll see. We'll tell. We'll see what's going on with that. Or I might just like. We'll work something out. Um, I'll probably upload like the first episode of this game and the first episode of Sonic Heroes from yesterday at the same. Both tomorrow. Got a lot of editing to do for tomorrow. Um, and then. Um, yeah, don't worry. I'll 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 keep an eye on that on that secret thing. Hey, thanks for remembering. <laughs> two day consistent viewer. Our record so far. But there's only been two days of stream since I came back. Okay, Rhyhorn is really damaged. I'm not sure Rhyhorn's the man for this. Like it's great that he can do stomp, but he's gonna be inconsistent. And he's not even up front. Well, I mean, I put him on the power, and I put him in the red slot. Does does the red and blue slot make a difference? Can someone let me know? That's what I want to know. Like, is it actually changing how the characters react? Because clearly, being in the lead makes you take all the damage. Hence, why Mr. Mime, with his 800 HP, is at like 500 now. Bloody hell! Good job, Onyx. Doing the best you can, as always. Onyx isn't going to be able to do much. Like close range. Oh, okay, you can do the hit. You can get that hit in there. Like, we can't do much as us two. Not really. It's Rhyhorn that has to do the thing, and he's still not got great health. I have a good feeling Auto is not going to save me. All right, that it doesn't go over the river; it just full on disappears. Now we know. <sighs> Damn it! The roar was just a tiny bit too slow. I should probably use that more. Use the roar to get them off of Rhyhorn. Use the substitute to distract them, and then use Stomp to take them down. That seems like the best scenario at the moment. Onyx can't do much. Like at the dis at this distance, he's just not not getting those hits in, you know. Yeah, have another substitute, so that, that last one doesn't disappear. Raw into it. I don't think Raw is doing any damage either, is it? Right, Stomp is our only form of attack, and he keeps dying so much, and this ain't... Nah, this ain't gonna be a good run. He's a glass cannon, he sure is, and he's not even a, the best attacker, I think. Well, actually, no, he's better than our Sludge Bomb guy. But, like, we're not being able to do a lot of damage like this. Substitute's apparently done nothing, because it, 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 I guess three have gone in the river now or something. This is all going to rely on Rhyhorn, and he's not even good. Like, he's only good at an angle. We're dead. We're a little bit dead. Right, flash cannon. Long range. It did actually hit them, so what can I, what can I complain about? Okay, 
I'm going to keep roaring as much as I can. Because that's our best bet. Roaring and substituting. And then when Rhyhorn comes back, I'll do something different. I don't know what I'm doing different, but I'm doing something different. Because yeah, Mr. Mime's about to go down. His substitutes did get out there. Right, Rhyhorn, you better come back soon. We need you, buddy. Right, what can Rhyhorn do? He can do a takedown. Nice, and he's gone. Right, Ry Onyx, you just keep on roaring. Doing the best you can. Mr. Mime's almost back, so we've almost got a substitute. Only the most tense of Pokemon Quest games here. Is this not just tense? Onyx, of all things, is being cornered into a river, actually. That is kind of dramatic. Like, in a Pokemon anime, if you saw giant Onyx being pushed into the river, that'd be pretty scary. But we'll go with it. Rhyhorn is our attacker guy. Here he is, he's back again. Stomp! And he all about to, he's about to die again. Yep, off he goes. It's slow, but I think it's working. Onyx is taking damage, but it's quite slow. I hope you like this sound effect. Oops, get a roar in there. And a substitute before he dies. Thank god Polyrath went the other direction. Oh man, these guys come back quick. Both of these moves are super quick. And Rhyhorn doesn't take too long to come back either. Nice. Okay. This is such a pro strat. Take down before you die. Thank you. Like, I honestly don't think I can do much else. Now it's just being cornered by all these water types. You know, maybe I shouldn't have all these rock types here in this water realm. I've just had that realization. This will be a good time for Pikachu. Someone recommended Charmander ages ago. Don't think Charmander would have helped very well here. What do we have that's good against water right now? Alright, Mr. Mime, thank you for that substitute. You did nothing, but alright. Take down. Good, you did something. Uh. Yeah, you're surprised it took me this long? I haven't been thinking about the typings, man. I've just been thinking about the moves and the powers. There's a lot to think about, and I'm very dumb. Alright, and I'm focusing on the stream, making sure things don't go wrong. And apart from my gameplay, it's doing okay. We haven't got frames in a long, long time. I see you still quite high, but that's fine. I have time to check these things out? Gosh, I must be doing really good. Oh, what, what, what? Like, seriously, look at this. We have all three of us miraculously alive. Probably not for very long, though. Get a takedown on that front. I should probably do... No, stomp. Which one does more damage? I don't actually know. Okay, substitute is gone. So is Mr. Rhyhorn. Just keep roaring him. Keep far away. Keep him far away. If we time it right, it might be timing it just around his actual attack, which is nice. Right, get a substitute in there. You didn't do it when I pressed it. Ooh, okay, Onyx has now taken damage. Get a stomp in there, and then we're gonna run away. Magic! Get one of those in. Another stomp, and a run away before he hurts all of us. You're not running away, Onyx. You did not press the button, or I pressed the button, you did not respond. Right, run away. You, Onyx is disobeying me! You seeing this? I'm pressing the run away button, and he does not do it. Why? That's the same thing as, as, ex as ex executes. Not sure if I've got time <laughs> to get the flash cannon. I probably should have. Alright. This again. No thank you. I do not need them. Let's go to the other level, shall we? Move Onyx's upper left stone in the middle. Okay. Flash cannon moves Pokemon away sometimes? Oh. Oops. Okay. I also just realized I could have shortcutted to that scene by pressing directly on Onyx. Right. Why does this make it glow? It will hopefully explain it to me soon. Nope. That there. That there. You sure? There we go. Why? Why does that make it glow? Because they're in a line? Like, they're not connecting anything. Just because it's in the middle, it's got double? I guess, yeah, it's the only combination where it's connected twice. So these two boost the middle one. Ah, oh, well. Whatever. 
Who needs the specific? Make a bingo. Gotcha. <laughs> Done now. Um, what was the other thing I wanted to do? There was something I was just about to do. What was it? Might have been it. We'll move to the other level now. Um, actually, does that count as expedition time? Can I get more Pokemon? What's my PM at? 30. We got five more. And maybe it will give me another five here? Well, I, just, I don't need another five. There's, there's only one more slot and this is back. Yeah. Get a bingo. Okay. Lane. Boss Pokemon if you get a bingo. Okay. Right. Cool. Uh, I mean, actually, I don't like Rhyhorn where he is right now. It'd be good if he was leveled up. I might level him up in the future. But I still think Execute did better. Um, he's got a power charm, so let me take this off him. But I think I'll do better with Execute if I give him more power. If I can. Or at least I can level him up from the defeats. Right? Something like that. Got two slots. They're not both hearts, are they? They are both hearts. Good lord. Okay. We're gonna go with it. Oh, I, I thought that was a really long menu because I looked away. Excuse me. Do one more expedition, then we'll get some Pokemon, then we'll change some things up. Let's go to the super easy level over here, shall we? We're way over leveled for this one. I'll get to the magnifying glass in the future. Uh, thank you, Teleth... Telethic? Thank you for the follow. I'm totally not judging your name. Weird, because I'm not used to saying some of these words out loud in the way that they're meant to be said, so... It's a new experience for me. Right, so this is, I'm guessing, the grass and bug type world. Which will be great for my ground rock type. Why is Execute still only on ha half HP? What happened here? Where'd you take so much damage, dude? Didn't you have like 700? Not a lot. What's going on here? Did my substitute disappear again? It did. Throw the substitute out there so it doesn't get distracted. How is that Metapod a threat? Okay, I see how now, but like earlier we saw it just like everyone was like, oh my god, it's a Metapod! Like it just squirms at you. Look at it. It's just like, mm, mm, mm. It's not really doing much, is it? It's trying its best, is what it's doing. It got it very, very far. <gasps> it's a gloom. Right. Hit it with a flash cannon. Throw in a substitute. When they're all distracted, give it a moment. They'll be distracted in just a moment. Look at them, all distracted. Hit him with the sludge bomb! That went in the complete wrong direction to what I had originally planned it to do, but it just didn't want to do it. Execute's dead. Because <laughs> I waited too long, I guess, so I didn't give it a demand. Oh well. Oops. I think next time I do the boss, assuming I'm, like if I was at the same point, I'd probably end up mashing flash cannon instead. Just because um, it does actually do the pullback thing, and it will damage them. And it was very nearly dead, so I could have just done that, but oh well. Although I guess it might have missed all the time because of the range, which would have been extra scary. But I mean, more tension is more tension, so... Metapod takes forever to kill? Oh, I can see that. It did actually last a little while, it's because of all that def- No, it doesn't have defense, it's all HP. This would have been a game I would have loved as a kid in the idea of it's only got HP and attack as its stats, because that's all I ever did as a kid. When I played Paper Mario and a Thousand Year Door at the first time, I put all my bone, like my level ups, into HP. Like I got to the, sh the uh, final boss, let's not spoil it, at like 100 HP, but I had nothing else. I had 5 FP, it was terrible. I never beat it. As you continue on your expedition, Moby's ability to detect items has improved. It will now temporarily be able to find more items for you. Just for this expedition, Moby will definitely be able to find a rare power stone with some special effect. Great! We'll get to that in a bit. Maybe you should take the stone off Flash Cannon and onto Roar instead? Will that make a giant difference? Is Roar good on Scattershot? Hot Pot a la Cube. Fire type Pokemon. Not another Vulpix, please. <gasps> Ponyta! Ponyta! 
I don't actually know. There's probably one of the, one of the uh, Pokemon I'm least... Yeah. Oh, oh, for a moment I thought it was called like Horsey, but that's that's the water type, so excuse me. I'm least experienced with this type because I've never actually had one before. Ponyto any good? I feel like not. It sounds like it might be quite... Um, wishy. Wishy. That was not the button I meant to press. What was that? What was that ring? Was that because of the execute? It might be in the execute. Right. Our Pokedoc- Pokedox? Pokedex is at 10. Thank you very much. Tumble Cube Island. Thank you very much. Is that all? Ooh. Oh. Saw a notification that said you dropped some frames. That was two hours ago. We're good. <laughs> um. Put some more things in here. Wash? Do I wash? I want that. I want more of this. But it ain't gonna give me a fire type. I know it won't. Nah, it will probably give me another rock type. But you know what? I'm going with it. It's a robot with stars in its eyes. Or it's crying. Either or. Or, I do not have time for four. I'll use all my PM tickets for ya. Rock type. God damn it. Alright. <laughs> Guess we're going with another Onyx. Oh, and it does actually have a different arrangement. Which might actually be more helpful because the other Onyx is all HP. Um, let's put some things in here first. Let's get a nice, uh, a nice gen. Now we've got plenty of water types. Get another one of these. And then let's look at our team. I'm going to compare Onyxes, basically. We've got two and two. Like, we give you all these. We really wanted two. Like, Onyx has got that and that. And that. We can give it less HP, but more attack. But we don't really want it to have much attack because it's only got the beams. It's probably better that it's got all that at health, I would probably say. But nah. Another scenario, maybe. But it has hardened. It has different moves. I did not even think of that. It's only got hardened. No. No, thank you. Just get a new move for Onyx if you want. So what, if I train it with a move type and use that Onyx, it might get that move? But I don't really want to get it hardened. Have a, let me have a look. Right. Okay, success rate 100%, which is nice. And then what, it's replacing one of these. I'm not sure... I uh, Do I want to use Harden on it, though? Probably not. I don't think so. Maybe I'll save it for an all Onyx team, as someone suggested. Yeah, sure. Yeah, Ponytail's only level 3. That ain't going to work, that dynamic. Let's move on. Uh, 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 uh. Let's have a look at the Pokedex. I haven't looked at that yet. I assumed it would show it to me, but I guess I had to press the button first. Yeah, well, only the first 150, not even the first 151. Tut, tut. And... Oh, that's the next page. I'm sure they put a lot of attention into these faces, but they kind of merge to me. Like, well, maybe not too badly. The earlier ones did. What do I know? Let's go. It won't give it hardened, but a random move. Better than Raw. I mean, actually, yeah, Raw hasn't given us the best in the past. You know what? I'll take that risk. If it's a random move and not harden, I'll try it. Yeah? Oh, I know you're only joking about the all Onyx team, but the idea sounds kind of cool, don't you think? Even though I'm going to probably lose it in training. Right. If I mean if it's compatible and it gives me something new, I assume if I highlight this one, that's the one that's going to change. Uh, that's a Rhyhorn, not an Onyx. 
and we're changing raw. Yes. How does this look? I need to know this animation now. And just to check, I haven't put them the wrong way around, right? Yes. Obviously, because otherwise the moves would be different. Gosh, they really do just beat each other till something works. Onyx forgot Roar and learned Stealth Rock. What is Stealth Rock? Didn't even want to tell me. Uh, the user creates pillars of stone from the ground, damaging enemies hit by them. Sweet! We've got double attacks mode now. Um, and still doesn't have still, still doesn't have sharing stone. Oh well. Um, humdy humdy hum. Does someone else have a slot for scatter shot? I might switch things up. Yes. This stomp. Oh, sludge bomb. Even better. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna give scatter shot to sludge bomb now. More explosions. What can go wrong? Onyx is on the moon. He sure is. Welcome, Shibe loser. This is Pokemon Quest. The newest Pokemon game came out yesterday. It's uh, weird and Minecrafty and a bit more of a mobile game. Very simple. Um, don't really know what else to say. Like it's you, you just gotta collect Pokemon, get their loot, and it's sort of real time. It's interesting and kind of addictive. Mwah. Lovely. Right. Stop the chew. Throw that out there. You guys can get distracted. Let's try out this new sludge bomb. Beautiful. It's going to hit them twice, most likely. Oh, that's awesome. Looks more like a fire move, that one does, but... Oh, well. Okay, not the best range on the sludge bomb, but that's fine. For that one for you. Sludge bomb for everybody. Flash cannon is now direct. That does a lot more damage. Oh my god. 289? My lord. Execute. Meet shiny execute. One of you is very clearly superior. Oh my gosh. This is beautiful. Perfect for Onyx. I have good feelings about this. This team. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is, this is good. I appreciate all of this. Thanks for the health. I'll put it on Onyx soon. Right, substitute for you that went through the tree. Can't go over a river, but it can go through a tree. <coughs> the only logical way. Don't get too spread out, because I need a sludge bomb for you. Lovely. Pokemon. More eggs to crack. Now slug bomb. So everyone can get confused on where they are. Flash cannon to beam right through them. Now the slug bomb because there's only one. It's basically like double damage, right? I'm sure. Oh lord, more just keep on appearing. I'm waiting for this boss now or something. Actually, no, it's only halfway through this wave. Never mind. Soon enough. Oh, I just realised you can see like the moves loading on the person. That's pretty good. Don't have to stop, I can stop looking at the moves so much. Not that it makes a major difference, I'm pretty sure they're both pretty fine. I still have to look down to actually choose the move actually, yeah. Maybe if it was just touchpad it would be easier and better, but I don't know. And maybe I can tap on the Pokemon to use their moves? No, it doesn't look like it. No, they're all fully done and not ready. HP thing execu execute can uh, equipped. Okay. So you're gonna leave now. See you later, Meep. Hope you have a good time wherever you go. There's that executor. It's not shiny though, so not my not not my deal. Wow, that's an interesting sound effect. Really weird sound effect, and I'm not gonna get used to that. But if we get an executor of our own, then we might get have to get used to that. But what move is he using? Like spore or something, maybe? Spores make explosions. I don't know. Oh well. 
Execute. Stop being so close range. If you can. Lovely. That barely did anything. Okay, maybe that wasn't so lovely. It's nice that they're finally leveling up again. Wow, a lot of hearts. Yeah, I do. I wonder the same, actually, if they'll add more Pokemon in the update. If there is an update, that would be pretty nice. Okay. We got things to do. How are things looking? I think we're doing alright as well, actually. Checking the stream and all that. Okay. Critical health hit damage. Time to recover less. Movement speed up. That's really good. That was the rare one, I'm guessing, that pops up. Time to recover. Okay. Yes, we will give that to you. And that for you. Actually got a housemate dying. Might have heard him coughing in the background. You might have not. Hmm. Anyone's uh, popular or knowledgeable of the Chibi Robo uh, sequel game that I half let's played? It's that guy. Do you remember his name? Or is nobody who's a fan of him a fan of this stream? Let me know if you know. It's a trivia note. What do you know? You'll get brownie points or something. Also. Thank you, Green Jay, for the follow. I saw it five minutes ago. Well, no, it says it's five minutes ago. Only saw it now. You don't think Nintendo has made an app without updating it consistently for a while? That's true. Like, the what was the game they brought out and then said there's going to be no updates? Was it Tomodachi Life or something? Something like, or they were like there was, or maybe it was Pokemon Go. There was something where they were like, we're just build, making this. There's nothing else. And it was like, oh, okay, great. Doesn't feel worth it then. I don't remember what it was though. Oh well. It is fun to see Nintendo as a mobile platform though sometimes, you know? Because it's like, everyone's playing them, and I'm like, yeah! Get into Nintendo, my dudes! Don't follow Call of Duty and all that crap! Follow me! Follow me and my inability to grow old. Yeah. I don't know, it's just nice. Like, when everyone played Pokemon Go, that was like the greatest month this century. And probably still will be. Until they make androids. And when Detroit become human becomes real, then that will be the next highlight of his life. But until then, Pokemon Go month. I like June, April time. That was the best there ever was. Okay, at this point I'm just mashing the moves because I can't actually tell where who's we're looking at what at this point. Flash cannon can hit multiple uh, Weedles. What a valuable opponent. Too spread out. It's better when they're all distracted by the substitute and then I mash on them all at once. Like, Onyx, what are you aiming at over there? You were looking, that's behind you. Dude. Ooh, I see a correct answer in there about that, uh, a trivia thing. Good on ya. Why don't I use the red things? Red stones, even. I don't know. The power ones? I guess there wasn't a slot for them? Or I'm dumb. You know, uh, since I saw someone mention it in about Fortnite in the comments, I'm not a fan of Fortnite just because I'm past the... I'm like, you know, I wasn't there when it sort of exploded and now I'm past the moment and it's just a bit beyond me and, you know, there's, there's the stigma of how much is overtaken. If I was there at the beginning, I'd probably be a really big fan of Fortnite because it's so nice and cartoony and colourful. Because it's so often that Onyx, what are you, what are you aiming at? It's so common now that like mainstream games are all kind of grey and boring and not very aesthetically pleasing. I mean, I guess maybe it's coming out of that a bit more. Or like, like Marvel's changed its new phase to be more colourful, so maybe that's more mainstream. But I like how Fortnite is actually colourful and cartoony. I'm really on board with that. I like the idea that colourful and cartoony is the accepted norm now. But I'm not a fan of it right now because the sort of the moment has passed. It's gone past its peak in like viewers' eyes. Like if I, if it was new, I probably would have, and I knew about it. I probably would have played it. But now it's so big that it's beyond me. If I played it, I'd only get hate and nobody would watch it anyway. You know? 
I've played a couple rounds actually and I've got the mobile app and I've played like three rounds because a friend of mine really loves it and wants to play with me all the time. Like, other than that, I'm not exposed to it. Probably would have liked it, but I can see it being very boring by now. It's very basic and broad and open. Kind of like Pokemon is trying to be at the moment. Now this is a good time for my throat to be giving me issues. I need a drink and it's tucked away down there. Ah, it's only Weeping Bell. I should be fine. Right. Tactical. Trying to do multiple things at once. Here's a Sludge Bomb and a Substitute. Whip out the can. Where's the Stealth Rock? There you are. Oh, you actually aimed half correctly this time on it. Good job on you. The irony of me being into colourful games. I know, I know. But maybe that's why, you know? If I'm seeing everything already at a dull saturation, because I'm colourblind, for those of you that don't know, but I feel like everyone does at this point. Um, maybe that's because, you know, if I see a grey film, it looks even more, a grey game, it looks even greyer to me. So it's even less appealing than a colourful game that looks only a little bit colourful with my eyes. Maybe it makes perfect logical sense. Or that's you know, just me. Get out of here, Weeping Bell, please. Like it's clearly, you're, it's clear you're not gonna win here. We're way overpowering you. Like, look at this. You're just cornered up. You don't know who you're attacking right now. You got you. Well, actually, you're not getting distracted by the substitute. So go you. But yeah, you can get out of here, please. Overwatch, you're right, has also pushed away that stigma. And I'm actually a really big fan of Overwatch because I was in the know when it was popular. I have no idea how. How did I know about Overwatch? Because I got it just as it got released. Like, I knew about it during its beta phases. I'm a really big fan of it. I've been tempted to play it as well on street, on Twitch and on stream. But again, it's so big that it's above me that like me playing that game wouldn't be worth it. But then again, I like playing games that I want to play game, like, I'm playing the games that I want to play at the moment. So maybe I will play an Overwatch stream. Or maybe it'd be like an afterthought that I do. I'll see how I feel, yeah. That's what really matters, it's how I feel. Make the streams I want to make and it makes the quality better, you know? I do have that giant list of games I want to play and one of them is Overwatch, so. More HP, more? Okay, I'll work on it. Weighted money that could be spent on evolving executor. Wait, excuse me. We can, we can. Do we have a executor needs a leaf stone? Is there a leaf stone available now? Hmm. Yellow wish Pokemon. I like this color scheming. It's ish, so I don't have to complain about it. Psyduck. It is a Psyduck. That looks quite cute, actually. What do you got? Confuse Ray. Nice, does no damage though. And Icy Wind, which does a little, uh, not a lot. Okay. So, I do not have money to put onto a Leaf Stone. Is there a, no, I couldn't find a, where do I get a Leaf Stone? What are you talking about evolving, Mr. Guy? No, there's not Leaf Stones down here, is there? Not that I really know what they look like. Wow, is this really all the ingredients you can get? There's not a lot of variety. Damn. Oh, oh, I see. The Chroma Glasses GoFundMe was related to that. Okay, excuse me. <laughs> you don't need a Leaf Stone. What do I need then? How do you evolve? How do you evolve the guy? You don't know. You just need to get him to a certain level. Oh. What level does Executor need? Uh, that's all I wish to know. Right, I'll do some updating with these stones. Hmm. This game really is like 70% menus. Kind of fun. Weirdly backwards way. Right, Mr. Mime can do no more. He's still not close to actually getting another half. Two more levels at least. You're all full with five chunks of health. You're welcome. 1080 HP. How did I not notice that last time? My lord. And. Ooh! Typical, we don't have the slot for it. We've, well, actually, we do. Oh no! Yes, we do. We have this. Here you go, execute. Execute. You're welcome. Is 
Everything okay over there? The stream hasn't frozen and died? You ain't chat for a while, but I don't know if that means you're frozen or if it's just because people aren't talkative. Could be both with me. Um, what can I put? Right, I need five of some. So I need uh, 15. Something that has 15. Might have to go for Mr. Generic over here. I want to save up so that there's 15 of a thing so I can get something more specialized. Okay, good, good. Do I think they'll reveal Pikmin Battle Royale? No, but if they did, I'd still like it. Wouldn't work anyway, like, unless you're playing as the Pikmin or something, or you got to get your own army in the game, but then they don't like having more than 100 on board, so if you had 100 players, you only get one Pikmin each, and they're not going to give you 100 each, maybe 50, but even then, you know, that's a lot of Pikmin to maneuver. That sounds like a programming nightmare. Ah. Are we getting another chunk of chocolate bar? I'm so lovely. But I do really think, I, I'm really starting to think we might get Pikmin at E3. Really hoping it. Even though Hey Pikmin was only like seven months ago. I can dream, damn it. Right. I'll tell you something about this game now. Only now, thankfully enough, the gameplay is starting to get a little tired on me. It might be because, I mean, how long have we been streaming? Wow, almost two hours. Doesn't feel like it. Feels like it's been quite a while, actually. Not because I'm bored, like I'm having a fun time. But the gameplay is not much more than pressing these same six buttons. And even then, I've only got five. Like, so I'd like, I would, I would at least like to um, complete this area and the other area. So what, this level and then two bosses. But like after that, like, I can't see myself going for another level. Or like, if I really wanted to complete it, I could, probably. But it's like, the gameplay is not gripping me as much anymore. Probably because I'm using the same moves and the same Pokemon. And like, this was the thing I did, like, people were worried about when they saw the trailer. The gameplay doesn't look the most intuitive. It's supposed to be casual and mod uh, mobile even, and I guess technically modern, sure. It's getting that broad audience, but now it's starting to tire on me. I have a two hour attention span, apparently. Do you, get the, do you guys get the same feeling? Like, is this getting a little tired on you? Because there is actually another game I would really like to play after this. Um, I'm in the mood to play some other stuff. So I, I imagine the stream won't be over, but I might, might stop on Pokemon Quest after this. I'll change up my title or something. Oh, I can't change my overlay to be more fitting, but oh well, maybe next time. We shall see. Also be interested to see how my how my view account goes for it. Well, whatever. Get distracted. Distract it? Distracted Ekans. Thank you very much. Bada bada bang. What I need is more like I think I just need more I need more satisfaction from the pots. With those Pokemon. It was really satisfying to get a shiny Execute, and an Onyx, you know? I need, and a Mr. Mime. I need more, is what I'm saying here. I got some really lucky rolls, I think. I need more of them. That was where this game shined most, it's that sort of random aspect there. I can see this playing out as a mobile game, actually, yeah. Like, this distracted me for a good two hours, and I can see myself coming back to this to occasionally do a level, like, every three days. And I'm glad I got it on the Switch, actually. Like, I do need more stuff on the Switch. At the beginning of the stream, you saw I only had five games, but before I turned it on this morning, I only had three. And even then, only one was played properly, I guess you could say. Like, I played Breath of the Wild 100%, aside from five core scenes. And then Mario Odyssey, I just rushed through the story. Um, are we about to die? Maybe. No, Mike the Mime has just come back. We ain't doing too great. I'm realizing now. We need more substitutes. Parasects, don't well fall for it, please. You and your demon cortisol cortisect enemy. Okay, Onyx is asleep. This is great. Okay, sludge bomb, please. And a flash cannon for you. And a substitute. And a sludge bomb, please. 
And a flash cannon for you. And almost a substitute. Lovely. That's the face of victory with a sleepy execute and everyone almost... Ah, uh, they're not actually that dead. We did okay. Could have done better. Hard to tell what level... Oh, someone leveled up here and this went around. Okay. There's not a lot more I can do. These guys are as leveled up as they can be. Like, power stones wise. Damn. You haven't caught a stream mine in a while, but you sound much happier and wholesome or something. Oh, it's nice to hear. Thanks, man. Surprised. Like, not to say that I'm on a downbeat, but this is like, I'm not, a, I still don't think I'm at 100%. Not on like emotions, but just because like, confidence at the moment. But that's mostly because I'm streaming while home alone, but I've been doing it. Well, I'm not home alone, but I've been doing this for two hours now, so maybe I'm just relaxing a bit. I don't know. I'm glad you noticed. Although I do remember one particular stream that I was feeling quite low energy anyway. Um, I won't say which one it is. You can feel free to try and find it yourself, I guess. Though I think I remember people really enjoying that stream, ironically enough. Like, maybe I, maybe I just, like, really got into it, like, in an ironic way. I don't know. I'm glad, you, I'm glad it sounds like that. I'll see you later, Shadow White. I gotta do a stream of Super Luigi Galaxy. If people really want to see it, I could do. I haven't played Mario Galaxy in ages. A year. Two years? No, a year. It was only a year ago that I played Super Mario Galaxy. Might do some Mar Super Luigi Galaxy 2. That's been a long, long time. Because I did want to show off all the ghosts in that um, live stream. I came back here for something. Was it anything in particular? I don't think I can upgrade anyone else anymore. No, I think it was to check on the food. So, this is the weaker boss. We'll go with it. We will go with it. Oh yeah, by the way, the next game I'm playing after this is going to be a secret. I can't just tell you straight off the bat. Um, I'm curious to see people's responses, but in all honesty, like, I'm just going to play it because I know I really want to play it, and I never got around to. People might not be as interested for it, because they might have already seen it, but then again, that might have been months ago that you saw it, so uh, we'll go with it. There you go, there's your hint. Haven't done a Let's Play hint in a long time, and I guess you could call it a Let's Play? It'll only be two hours max, because it won't let it be any longer. There you go, that's all the hints you'll get. Alright. Get thinking. I'm not going to confirm or deny anything. Oh. Time. Oh, it's 21. Well, 21, no one says that. It's 9 o'clock. That's surprising. Yeah, I guess I might as well make it. So then I'll, I'll, I should end up soon. So then I can actually get some nice amount of sleep. It is kind of important. I've got to be up early because I've got so much stuff I need to do tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be streaming again tomorrow, but I cannot guarantee. <laughs> Cooking Mama. Is that only two hours long? I did actually have it for the Wii ages ago. I don't remember enjoying it that much. I was just like, oh, I get it. And that was it. Back in the day when I apparently bought anything for the Wii. No, I guess now I probably, yeah, I saved up money and I saw it was new or it was really cheap or something. I don't actually know the logic behind it. I remember where I was and where, what bedroom like I was in when I played it. That's about all. Hmm. Oh well. Voting my memory was better. I do seem to have a major problem with memory lately anyway. Like I write everything in a book each day, like I log my days just so I can remember what happens more extensively in, in hindsight. But I've been doing it for like a year, two years now or something like that, coming up to two years. And so now it's to the point of if I don't write something in a day of in that book, I will forget that day. It's probably not always the case that there's something mental, but it's like, it's almost like I rely on that book for my memories now, which is kind of scary. But it's not too bad because I'm mostly on top of it. So I could logically remember more than most people because I'm so on top of it. But if I didn't have it, I have no idea what I'd be like. And for the whole month of April I didn't write in the book because I was busy editing my uh, final film. And to be fair, I remember bits of it, and I, but then I also generally wouldn't remember most of it anyway because it was just grinding editing work. But now the most of that month is gone as well. I don't really remember what I did before and after, like before I went to uni and after I came back, so I, eh. Oh well. I've got other people's <laughs> pictures and vlogs to make me pick things together. 
Not that I vlog, I just have a friend that vlogs. Fish, fish, fish. Ramble, ramble, ramble. You thinking of making a series for the regular mansion in Luigi's Mansion? I hadn't really thought about it because everyone's played Luigi's Mansion. Everyone's done the regular mission mansion. I wanted to be different, so I did the hidden mansion and then didn't get full rank. So I would like to play it again, maybe, so I could beat my, you know, actually get rank A or rank S. There's also the new Luigi's Mansion on the DS, which sounds kind of cool, but I don't have a lot of money right now. I'm trying to be quite um, efficient with my finances, so I probably won't buy it just to play it again. But probably not. There's a lot of demand for it, maybe, but you'll have to, you'll have to vocalize it yourself. So uh, playing Luigi's Mansion was the one and only time that I got legitimately kind of creeped out while recording because I was trying to get that uh, trivia note of Luigi being hanged as a shadow and because it was dark and I had to, you know, it was during the blackout and I had to go into that room, I was legitimately kind of freaked out by it because seeing it is freaky to me because I didn't know it as a kid, I just saw it when I was older and I was like, ooh, that's horrifying, you know? Wasn't fun time. You might be able to hear it in my voice, but probably not. It was just as I was walking into that the room with the f the, 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 the phones in it. That's when I was like, Ugh. but it, it probably didn't come out that loud. Maybe I just like my my voice might have cracked and got a little bit louder, but otherwise it's probably not that obvious. We're about to die here. We might be about to die here. Um, execute. At least get in your last hit. Okay, Mr. Mime is back. You can throw out a substitute last minute. Thank you very much. This can hopefully take out people a bit faster, but not not really. I'm kind of mashing buttons and I'm too busy telling stories, but oh well. Bum bum bum. Jesus Christ, why is Beedrill right on top of us? That's not very friendly. Okay, are we all alive? We are! Okay. Not for very long, Execute looks like he's just about to die, but oh whatever. Let's not aggro him too much, shall we? Okay, that's most of these guys gone. Throw out another substitute, hopefully Beedrill will fall for it. I could really be using Flash Ranger, it's a lot better. Hopefully the sound of me mashing the button isn't too annoying. Okay, Flash. Might be better, I cannot tell. That you? I didn't even see it use Flash Cannon, did it use it? Try again, buddy. It's still not down, and everyone else is though. Okay, thankfully they're distracted by Substitute. A little bit, not for very long though. Execute is almost back. We're gonna need that. Uh, okay, wow. This was super close, and I'm sorry it had to go like this. Execute, you are barely gonna run away. You do not like running away, do you? <laughs> okay, we might be able to do a little bit of damage. This substitute... Oh, Onyx is almost back. Just survive a little bit, just so we can get that substitute in. Well, we did get it in already. Oh shoot, no! Onyx was right there! Man. I've lost from two bosses now. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm getting destroyed. Okay. Ow! That was way- that was weaker than the other one! I guess because I was just mashing up a bunch. We're at 2600, we should be okay. <laughs> Let me go back. Maybe I'll train a Pokemon quickly. Level it up real, like a sneaky level up. I think that is what I'm gonna do. We're gonna get another Pokemon, we'll train up one of my teammates. Hopefully get another like power slot for him and go from there. Assuming I've got the pot slot. Yes I do. A red stew a la cube. Are they all a la cube? It's not that inventive. <gasps> Floating one. I don't actually know. Oh, Goldeen. No wonder I didn't get it, because I assumed it would be a fire type. And give me the other sound effect. Thank you. Level 15 though, actually. And then we'll put some more things in here. Do we have 15 of anything? Still no. No. More blues, please. Not grab this to save my life. I 
Okay. I was gonna say, I just checked these, but it's because I got a dish. Makes kind of sense. Excuse me again. Right. Now, let's train somebody. First things first, who do I want to train? You're not even close. You're not even even close. Executor is executes probably the best one. Let me look at their power chains. That's what I want to check out actually. More than anything. Okay, so executes close. We're getting that that power. Um, Onyx is not. And Mr. Mime is not. Okay, we're going to be leveling up Execute. He's the closest one, and he's the closest to his power slot. The only way. Uh, where are you? Execute. Hey, you. We're just going to throw things at the wall and see what sticks, okay? So here's a horsey for you. Here's a Vulpix. Here's another Vulpix. Here's a Ponyta. Now, if I swap anything out, you go higher or lower. Makes no difference. Really? All a. Why? Okay, who's my lo who's my most valuable out of all of these? Probably the horsey. Oh, so we'll just throw Goldeen in there. See, very faintly better. Okay, we won't. Um, well, we've got two Volpixes, and if they're the same, right? Does these two make a difference? No, they don't. We'll put in the lower level one. Any objection? Let's move learning, that's why. Does that make a difference then? Is that actually gonna make a... Yes, it does. Oh, shoot. So maybe I will have to put in Goldeen. Which I am probably go with. Yeah, it's a big bulk. Oh, there's Rhyhorn as well. It might be a sacrifice I have to make, because like these are the highest ones, and they're not doing anything. Hey, look at that. That's Eevee. Let's not put in Eevee. <laughs> hmm. Any objections with this then? Because I can't really do anything else. Like, I need to get a guy leveled. Not Eevee. Don't worry. Eevee is now safe here, I think, unless this is Eevee, but I'm pretty sure it's a Vulpix. I see current issues. Nope, go for it, I think that works, great. Let's bash, let's watch an egg defeat a fish, a seahorse, a fox, and a rock monster. Never thought it could be done, but here it is in the flesh. <laughs> so cartoony, and one of them wasn't even looking the right direction. That's how strong they are, okay. I don't think that, no, there's no more power stuff I can do. Unless I got something better. Yes, I do. Okay, even better. We're switching out. Onyx, you only have HP. So, Mr. Mime, you don't have attack stuff. Well, you do, but it doesn't make a difference. Why have I given you attack stuff? Because you have attack stuff. Time to recover. HP upon recovery. We want stuff with bonuses. There is not an option. Movement speed. Sure. hit damage we do not need. I probably want... Nah. Nah, we should be fine. I'm trying to think what I can replace with what, if it makes any difference. I've got lots of HP options here. You have that one, which doesn't make a difference. Not much. No, I think Onyx's HP is fine. Do not require a difference on that. Execute. You die a lot. Yeah, you're kind of low in general. With you. So what's the best one of these we got? Just like that kind of. Hmm. I think yeah, this would be better on Onyx. But here, let's give you a chunky boost. You're a little bit higher. Give this to Onyx. Pop them out. Also, you're not glowing anymore. Now you are. Would it help if I put this in the glowing slot? Probably not. 
but I'm doing it anyway. And then we'll put you in two, and it's the only the best ones. Have that. Turn around. Uh, there you go. Right. I'm sure that'll be great. See you later, Shiva. I believe you're the one going. Yes, it is. It was nice catching a stream of yours. It sure was. I'm glad you were here. Whether I noticed or not, I'm glad you are. Oh, I can, I can just train this guy twice. That would. Problems. But yeah, see you later. Pokemon are not limited to moves, they also have weaker auto attack. I'm like, 90%. Okay. True. Fine. Okay. I'll do a little bit more training to get this guy right up. Whoops! Volpix. You level him up. No. And Pony... T I'm gonna get rid of everyone for my core people. Damn it. I mean, it works. I'm gonna have to. I'm sorry, guys. We'll catch up. All to be sacrificed to the bunch of eggs. It still didn't get us close to that power thing. Wow, this is really a grinding game, isn't it? Clearly a mobile game. We've got our core three and Eevee. That's what we're ending off with. Two and a quarter ways in, and that's what this game's given us. Okay. Ah. Lovely. Let's get out of here. Mm. I'll drop the Nintendo Joy-Con. The music's also slightly turning me crazy. Hmm. This one or that one? I'm going for this one again. We don't have a bonus move here. So we've got two, six, twelve here. And an extra bit here. You know what? We'll go back. Onyx has a portrait that looks like a mustache? Oh my god, he does! Oops. I'm not going to be able to one see that now, am I? Thank you. <laughs> that is really distracting. It's a very fancy Onyx. Ha ha. He defeats people with his stealth rock of gentlemanness and his flash cannon of power. I don't know, that's, that's just terrible jokes. That was an attempt. <laughs> it's funny, I'm supposed to be a jokey guy. I am in real life, Rooney. Well, to say I'm really funny is kind of <laughs> a bit over the top, but you know, I'm generally quite jokey. I'm good at improvising jokes. Almost my career at this point, but not on streams apparently. I guess I'm too prompted. And I usually make context jokes anyway. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> Polywag, get out of here. Thank you very much. Mr. Mime has, again, lost all his HP. Isn't Mr. Mime the one at 1080p? Or is that Onyx? Might be Onyx. Yes, it is Onyx. He's the one with five HP slots. It's me. Don't know my own Pokemon. Good job, Onyx. Doing his best as always. I don't fully understand what Flash does again. I keep forgetting. Onyx, what are you aiming at? There you go, you're on a you're on target this time. What's the logic behind Onyx's targeting? Can someone tell me? Seriously. Flash ups speed. Oh. Oh, I even see it. Yeah, the symbol is a plus foot symbol. Symbol, but sideways. Oh, it's it's running to the left. Oh. Okay. Doesn't really feel much faster, but I'm sure it is. Be sure to get rid of it soon. Maybe I'll give it a move learning training. I can't because it's all gone. Well, if we ever get another execute, I'll uh, I'll be sure to give it another move. It's not the most helpful. Like I'm sure it's great having status moves and it's great for the pros, but not for me. Right, let's get out of here. How are we doing on HP? Mr. Mime's almost down, but that's not too bad. 
just gotta be careful of that uh big beastie guy we had from before, the water guy. Oh, oh it was a party raffle, wasn't it? Was that the other one? So out of touch. Okay, flash cannon would be great right now, because they're all lined up. Look at them, all stuck on that substitute. Bam! It didn't feel like it did that much. Oh well. Oh, he's got a move back for us. Got alternatives. Delph Rock misses again. <laughs> ah. Get distracted by the substitute. There's two now. Take your pick. Lovely. Also such bomb missed last minute. Bada ba ding. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking that if I get a second execute and it's shiny, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Any chance shiny gets better buffs? Like, oh, are you kidding me? It can't go over that tiny corner? My substitute just got lost and Mr. Mime's gonna die. Because of it all. Yep, off he goes. Great. Do it a second early and it's gone. Ooh! Notification! First of all, I've realised I've missed three, so thank you, Cheldio, for the follow. Uh, I will look in a moment once I've thrown this stealth rock out. Uh, thank you, just Pokemon 164, and thank you, Tramunus. Weird, why'd I get a notification for that one and not the other ones? Oh well. Much appreciated anyway. Thanks for sticking around. Hope you'll stick around further. We'll, maybe we'll play more Pokemon Quest tomorrow as well. I'll see how I'm feeling. I'm gonna play the games that I feel like playing, and I felt like playing Pokemon Quest today. So here we are. The variety streamer here. So I do have some things definitely put in plan. I've got I've even got a strategy for one of my series. I've got an actual full-on live stream series planned where I'll be playing just that game for a while. Or at least that series for a while. But I'm not starting that series till a certain event happens in real life first. I'm really playing tactical on this. And also because I'm still half setting it up. But uh, you know, whatever. And I'm trying to get into it more, you know. Be less rusty when I start that series. What will that one be? <laughs> you can guess as much as you want. You probably won't guess it. Or maybe you will. You could do, actually. It's not that far away, logically. Not out of nowhere. Um, well, not for me. We'll see. Or it is for me, but not for reality. You know what? Never mind. I'm completely distracted myself. It's my own version of Substitute over here. The polyrath has taken not a lot of damage, actually. That didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. Right, Onyx, you got lots of HP. Yeah, you survived that hit nicely. Please just hit. Mr. Mime, hit him with a substitute. You even got it on land. Go you. Yes. That's good on you. That's good on this. Of course, he's surrounded by rivers, though, so it's like everything's going to miss. That was an accidental rhyme. Don't mind me. Bam, bam. Look at this. Finally taking him down. Come on, a couple more hits. BAM! That took- that was a little faster than I expected as well, just a simple, like, 261 health or damage? And everyone's alive? Wah! Nope. Mwah! Beautiful. That's character development. No one leveled up though. Not that much to character development. Development already happened. You discovered the Spring Shadow Statue. Great. Got a new statue. What could this one be? This is the Spring Statue Statue. The statue is carved in the shape of Poliwag, a Pokemon that has the power to use Rain Dance. If I were blessed with plentiful rains, I would never run out of water. That is sure true. I'm glad you know that rain is made out of water, Daz. You're a smart one. There are more areas to explore nearby. Perhaps we should head out to another expedition? Yeah, okay. Around, I'll get around to it. First more Pokemon, please. And a new kind of cooking pot. Okay. I guess I can cook multiple things at once now. I'll take that. What's going on next? That's a good attack stone and place down the statue? Okay, I will do. You can change the cooking pot with a change button. The amount of ingredients you need to use when you cook a dish will increase, but Pokemon that are level 16 or higher will be attracted. Okay. Even the same species of Pokemon that you've attracted before will have higher HP and attack when you use more ingredients. I see, and I can get four cooking pots. Gotcha. Right, first things first, let's whip down this statue. 
because apparently it's just that good. Oh, that's what that animation is. Um, and that puts it away, I think. Yes, it does. So what is it? It do just because it looks nice. Okay, whatever. Um, that's not done yet, but I will. Uh... Oh, it goes less and less. I didn't know that. Yes, we'll do that. Sure. Only got a cup, one expedition left technically, so. It's a polywag of our own. Or a polywhirl. That's a polywag, yeah. Thank you very much. Ba -da -ba. All right, I want to use this new cooking pot, please. More kinds of cooking pots will be unlocked as a request quest reward when you progress through expeditions on island. On the island. Ingredients of the amount, okay. There's still just a 15. Yes. We'll go with, well... And substitute for any other ingredients. Oh, well then we'll go for an icy one this time, shall we? Because that will fill us up fully. Hope this is correct. Start cooking. Let's get a strong ice Pokemon soon. Not that I can see it, because I ain't got the bits for it. I need 60, but it will be less later. Theory. You have to spend real money on the other pots? Oh man, that sucks. Well, problem solved, I won't do it. I pressed the wrong button. Or I didn't think the button was optional. Movement speed up, normal. Okay, can I sort these in any way? Oh, I'm sure it doesn't matter. Okay. We need an A power slot, which I can upgrade. There we go. Nice and simple. There's a couple here, actually. Let's boost Mr. M Let's not boost Mr. Mime right up. Now that I think about it, I don't think that would be very logical. No one has... No one has the things that we need. Great. We're still not leveled up enough. Great. <laughs> Is this worth getting? It's free! And it's entertained me for two and a half hours now. So... I haven't spent any money on it, so I guess why not? A lot of value for, for no money. Try it out. Uh, treat it like a demo, you know? Right, okay, let's try this again. <clears throat> Where's our enemy? Wild Pokemon. There you are. There you go. Slug bomb that completely misses the Weedle is always fun. Execute. You can't even hurt this guy, can you? Like, okay, Onyx is here, don't worry. He'll actually save the day and do something. Yeah, you're still missing that Weedle, Onyx. Uh, execute. You're trying your best, but it's not too great. I don't know why I spammed both those moves. So you're aiming at the same Weedle. Is this even a Weedle? Is it the other one? The Caterpie. Cat cat That's the one. Excuse me. They're very similar. They're the same generation, aren't they? Yeah, because we saw one earlier. Yeah, it's Metapod and other Metapod. I remember that. They're like duos. For some reason. Because they immediately didn't know what to do with different Pokemon ideas or something. I still don't see the part where I have to pay real money. I guess I can do it for tickets. Is there a paywall later? Like, am I about to hit the paywall? Because uh, maybe it was in the shop earlier, but like, if it's just that, then we're good, you know? I 
I need to be more focused. I was sort of zoning out there because I'm just like, this is generic gameplay, but this is the boss that I've died to like three times now. So more focus would be good in all honesty. Who's aiming at who? Okay, that's that guy still not down. Onyx can not quite get both of them down in one hit or just down at all. Blood bomb on you. Thank you very much. Oh, ready for another angled flash cannon. Lovely. And it's just you left, buddy. You can take him out. Can't you execute? No, you can't. Mr. Mime, you can do it, right? No, Onyx had to do everything, of course. The Mime is almost down again. I can't help them at this point. They don't, they don't improve. I can up I can up Mr. Mime's HP. Because he's got so much He's got so much power slots here that I can't really do much else. He's half and half, I think. Oh well. Right. Delf on that tree over there. Good job, uh, Onyx. You are the best. That also only hit one guy. Onyx, your flash cannon should hit more people, but it doesn't. Throw out another substitute because it's all Mr. Mime can do. I mean, yeah, he's got automatic moves, but like, yeah, I don't use them very much. Maybe Mr. Mime is not the right guy to have. Well, he's got plenty of stuff, doesn't he? He's got loads of HP or something, but he's got too much power slots. I need to give him a move is what I need to do. Oh, it's these guys. Weird seeing him in such small cube form. I'm not used to it. That was very quiet, but maybe it's because I got my volume all the way down. Maybe that actually meant it was really loud. Okay, this is the one I actually need to be focused on. So, what's everyone doing? Is someone already dead? Mr. Mime is already dead, and I can't use that. And Substitute is our best set, and I think it's down in front to see where it is. It might be gone now. I can't move the camera angle at all, but that's fine, I'm sure. Black Bomb, get everyone away from here. Oh right, it was a stealth rock that came a chain. I remember seeing that earlier, but assumed it was just the logo. I've seen it a couple times now. I didn't mean it was like locked away, maybe? I don't know. Everyone get distracted with the substitute, if you please. And then I've got my double sludge bomb again for you all. It's hard to tell, like, I wish the HP was also on the bottom order of the Pokemon this thing. And I could tell a little more of what's going on. It's like I've got to find where they are to see where their HP is. It's a bit distracting, you know? Right. There's a Stego. Get distracted on that sl on the on the substitute, please. Um, let me check Onyx's damage next. Although actually that does a fair bit already, so. Okay, so the sludge bomb I think missed. Here's flash cannon. It's doing uh, like 190 or 294, one or the other. And this one does, oops, no damage because it missed. That's what it's doing. Okay, time for flash cannon, because it can apparently teleport on top of us, but it does a little bit of pushback. This is what we want, yes. Success. Execute is halfway done. Mr. Mime is even faster. Get out of there. Okay, time for substitute, straight off the bat. And we're all gonna get a lot of damage done. Okay, he's almost down. Push him back. Thank you. Don't get closer to him, please. Thank you! With a, like, one HP Onyx. I am destroying this Beedrill this time. Phew. Still got a little close, though. Right, Mr. Mime, you still don't have anything new. Good lord, this is a, this is slowing down this gameplay, isn't it? Okay, but let's just see what our final earnings are. With a Doduo I didn't even see in this area, but okay. I've discovered yet another statue. This one makes three. This is the flourishing statue. statue the statue is carved in the shape of Doduo. Maybe whoever made it that believed that Doduo's physical strength would lead to successful development of the island. Where they know where they're getting all these metaphors from, I have no idea. Seems you've explored everything you can in this area. I'll locate the route to the next area. 
It may take some time to locate, so in the meantime, I've searched the database. It can, it's said to be a place far out on the island that no one has ever reached. Beep, beep, boop, beep, beep, beep. What's wrong, Moby? The statues are the key to the land cha cha chamber of legends. You've got a lot of stuttering there. If we gather enough of the statues that lie hidden on the island, we can reach the chamber of legends. Beep, beep. <laughs> Okay. So I guess the thing that's reacting is not Moby. I thought we restarted that and it's still making issues? Oh well, I can't follow this. And I don't need to. Route to the new area detected. Let's head out a little further. This is a little more than a little bit. That's half the, the extra. We've only done half of this whole path now. My lord. Okay. Place the statue down. Okay, is it that important? Like, the Chamber of Legends is ages away. Thanks for the reminder, but... Wow. They're a loud one. The Grinch. There are purchases, but there aren't any game-breaking stuff. The game can be played without spending real money. That's cool. I like that. Good stuff. Okay, flourishing statue. You are also to go way down here. Out of the way, so I don't have to think about it. very much. Um, I am not going to get to see the end of this, unfortunately, am I? That's a shame. And I also can't upgrade my, pick my Pokemon anymore. <laughs> I haven't got anything new that, like, changes anything. I've got another Scattershot. Well, I'll give it to Beam as well. What's my other moves? Yeah, no, not really anything worth it. Here you go. And we got double the Scattershot. And another Heart thing. But you know what? Sure. There you go, Onyx. Now you got one, one, two, seven. Aren't you happy? Does does have more like more stones? Am I missing? Am I lacking? Am I like having bad luck on the game now? Is it exp to Pokemon under level fifteen if you place it down? Ah, uh, okay. Mine having lots of HP, but all his upgrades or attack is this game's equivalent of a Pokemon having the perfect nature but the wrong ability. Sounds like it. So, I've died a third amount of times. Died on sus. Wow. Okay, fair enough. Also, seeing the four minute notification, Diamond Catcher 57, thank you for the follow. But I'm afraid at this point, I'm, uh, I'm a little done with Pokemon Quest. Mm.